Hello, hello, Danger Noodles. As you can see, I created something new for my streams. You see at the bottom uh, right corner. Oh, wait. You dragon can't see it. Basically, oh, I have a shiny... Uh, huh? I was going to say, ah, yes, I see. I see it so very well, yes. What a, what a beautifully designed little thing you've added there, Bright. Very well done. Yeah, basically it is a shiny sandy ghast and a number. But watch what happens. Uh, well, you can't see it. It's gonna... It goes up and down, depending on what number I hit. So I got a shiny counter. Uh, I thought that would be interesting. Also, please, for the love of fuck, Bright, use auto-battling. Please, it will speed it up so much. No, I know you don't like you. it, but please, for the love of fuck, it will speed it up so much. It's annoying, yes, but it will speed up so much. I don't give a fuck. Fuck you. Please. No. No, Volkram. It's not 30 shinies. It's 30 sandy gas I've killed, I think. I'll definitely have to, uh... Please, Bright. Shut the fuck up, Dragon. No. <laughs> also, uh... I also recommend, while you're doing this, look out for the water. Because the water is so weird in this game, where it in some of the shinies are like it blends in way too much with the water. Wait. In the Did Pokedex. You get a shiny off the stream? Uh no, I'm checking to see if. Let me see. Yes, we sent the shot. I'm gonna see if I actually did kill 31. So I might be wrong with my number. Because I know even Pokedex can tell you how many of you've battled. And I've only caught one, and then I stopped fighting them. For Pokédex, so... Alright. Bulky Geist. Unless they got rid of that. Aww. Did they get rid of it? Yeah. Oh, that's so stupid, because that actually helps you. Eh. Oh, well, Aww. I'm just going to assume 30, because I can't... I don't fully know. <laughs> but, yeah. Oh, yeah, my beginning words. Uh, Hatchet, you're going to hate this. Apparently, some cook said that Canadian lobsters and... Main lobsters are the exact same animal. Okay. I mean, that makes sense. Your words I mean, on that? Prob I mean, it probably doesn't. It's just this. It's just a person who doesn't uh have any degrees in uh relevant field making a claim on a field like that shit's dime a dozen yeah i will find a shiny sandy gas i have as much as i want There's nothing you can do to stop me, Dragon. We just got dead quiet. Eating. No, you're not allowed to eat, Hatchet. Fuck you. Mm. Mm. <laughs> oh, shoot. I forgot to add it to counter. That's probably 33. Yeah. I'm a dumbass. <laughs> I feel like that's going to be clipped. Just me saying I'm a dumbass. <laughs> That needs to be a sound bite. No. Or a sound alert. 
I'm very I'm limited a... on yeah. cell arts anyway. <laughs> Make it a make it a point redeem. That's what I'm gonna be working on tomorrow with more editing and uh getting that done. Oh with the voice things, all that. Alright. Murder them. And I, I still have trouble saying a Japanese name. Jerry told me to call it the Parados. <laughs> they are simply N. Yeah, they're, they're N now. They're. Wow. They're the free spirited green hair bitch boy. Now. What? 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 <laughs> we started calling what? Gyarados N. Uh huh. And they're green haired and free spirited. In what way are they green haired? Yeah, I'm pretty sure they're scaly. I was talking about the actual N for a day or for a moment there. Okay. Yeah, What's the actual. The act the oh, actual yeah. N? Yeah, there's a Pokemon character just called a letter. N. Oh. Yeah, th th he that's was his raised name. in a cult. Yeah. He was raised um... in a cult and can talk to Pokemon. Actually, a really cool thing about N that I really like is fun fact about his teams. So you have to kill him, but the thing about his teams is he'll catch Pokemon from around the roots, or like the route that you just came off of to go fight him. He'll catch the Pokemon and then he'll he'll release them back onto that route. Uh. Aww. Yeah, he's actually a good guy compared to his family. <laughs> he's a good guy. He's just in a cult. Well, then again, that cult then becomes good in like the sequel, like half of them, because they help defend you. Yeah. Shellos has a terrible shiny. Yeah. And then the the scientist who made Genesect it becomes good. Yeah, and you get to see him in 3D with Pokemon Sun and Moon. Or Ultra Sun and Moon, technically, I'm pretty sure. Yeah. I put some Vix under my nose. Why? To help clear up my nose and on my chest because that's what my family always does when I when people have stuffy noses, and it hasn't worked. It sucks for you. Yeah. You know what? I want to go buy a pick right now. I don't think does leaving destroy the shiny count or no? No, you're fine. Okay, good. It's not like other games where like you just leave it up. Oh, you gotta start over. Yeah, no, this game is very friendly with, with shiny hunting. Actually, Bright, I have a shiny I want to give you because it's a duplicate. I want I want to give you it. I think you'll like it because it's it a black a bla shiny. Okay. Yes. You want it? I, I guess. I mean, I don't know okay, if it's on my I'll list. It. It, it's, I think you'll like it. And it's a duplicate anyways. I didn't want it. I wanted a, I was going for a different shiny, but I got it. And I don't really want him, so... Well, I guess before I go... Wait, where do we find the picks? Uh, uh you can go, uh, to the... To go to where you buy ingredients. If you go to the bottom, usually that's where you buy the picks. It's, it's it shows a little basket, but it'll say pick. I have our presents. Uh, oh, I like Artist Zone has a bunch of shops that sell ingredients. Artisan Bakery? Is that what you said? No, the oh. the the art yeah artisan the where the grass gym is. Okay. Well, I just, I guess I'll go there first. Then I don't know where the fuck the grass gym is. It's artisan. That's where the grass gym is. Right down there. It's, it looks like a pokeball. 
This, this oh, I didn't even fight the gym off. leader yet, so I could I see clear as day. Oh wait, no, that's the bug lady. Never mind. Yeah, it's the opposite of the bug lady. The opposite direction. All right, I'll fly there. The opposite direction of the bug lady. Yes. You are awful at giving directions. You can go fuck yourself. Sure. All right. So, uh, I gotta take a really big shit, so I'll be back. <laughs> oh. oh, that's pleasant. Catch it. Entertain the stream. As well as you book. No. But yeah, bookworm. Unfortunately, if you're typing, I will not be able to see it because I do not have my browser open. What's this? What's this? Why? Is Festus being bad? No, Festus is being a good boy. Aww. He is snuggling. Aww. So I give him many pets. And, Yippee! And generating static electricity and seem to be annoying him with the pets because of it. What should I name this shiny before Bright gets back from taking a shit? What should I name it? Name it, the, name it something funny. The shiny you're gonna send to Bright? Yeah. Um... Um... I mean, what kind of Pokemon is it? Uh, it's Sea Toddle, so it's a whale. Uh. Pat Fuck? I'm going Fat Fuck. I hope it lets me put Fat Fuck. I don't think it will. Could just name it Redacted. <laughs> it won't let me put Fat Fuck. Yeah, how about you just name it Redacted? Okay. Oh, my Festus. I can't fit Redacted, so I'm going to put Fat Redact. <laughs> fat Redact. <laughs> I think that would work. It's very funny. But what do you mean you can't fit Redacted? Well, I wanted to put the little bracket, so with the brackets, I can't, I can't fit redacted. So I'm gonna try. Okay, without the rack, but okay, without the brackets, I can. Yeah, there we are. Fat redacted. Yeah. I'm gonna make it useless. How are you gonna make it useless? I'm gonna make it forget all of its moves. And oh. only remember, it's only gonna know amnesia. It's gonna be <laughs> an amnesiac. Wait, then that's perfect for its name being redacted. It's forgotten everything. <laughs> All of its moves have been redacted. Wait, what if I name it D-Class? Oh my god. Go ahead. I'm naming it D-Class. I'm, I'm naming it D-Class. There's no way you'd be able to fit amnestics in there. There we are, D-class. Wonderful. Wait, does D-class have a dash, or is it just D-space space, space dash? Or it's space class? I think both are possible, but I would probably do a dash. I put, yeah, I put dash. D minus class. I think Bright will like it. 
I have to tell her to uh, to look at the moves though. I think it, I think the funny yeah. fun it'll become funny when she looks at the moves. I'm also trying to make a uh, I'm accidentally totally by accident raising a penguin army, uh, because I want a pink penguin and I have not gotten a pink a pink penguin yet. So I have hatched over ninety. Oh, uh, for um, fuck's sake! You're doing the same thing. The worst part is, is uh, these aren't edible, and they aren't native to the Pokemon Scarlet game. I am making an issue. It's not even with Appalin where it might be an issue. This is actually just an issue. Uh, this is an invasive species. There is no, there is no uh, forgiving what I am doing right now. And at least you're willing to admit it this time. But look, it's pink. Okay, it's pink. Festus, why do you get into fights? Festus is secretly a Pokemon. Yeah, Festus, Festus has... yearns for the mines. Yeah, I just noticed that Festus has a tiny little scratch that is literally half a centimeter away from having God in his eye. Oh, fuck. Do you know about the, the, the children yearn for the mines meme? No, I ha No, I do not. So, you know how Minecraft's really popular, right? Well, yeah. It has made, uh, especially with children, so it has made people jokingly deduce that the children yearn for the mines. I see. Festus yearns to be a Pokemon. Let Festus be a Pokemon. Uh, no. Why? I I do not consent to allowing my cat to be used as a fucking fighting rooster. Why not? Because he deserves better. Fair. Oh, uh, God, I'm so tired. I have slept for, like, 12 hours today. I have slept for, like, 5 hours today. Get more sleep. Sleep right now. I'm going to snap my fingers and you will sleep. Sleep. Oh, wow. I'm totally sleeping right this moment. Yay, it worked. See? Don't you feel great? That you're sleeping right now? Someday I'll die and then I'll know peace. <laughs> mm. Hashtag relatable. I'm gonna eat some strawberry ice cream. I am in the funny Pokemon game. Also, how do you feel about the fact that I am a millionaire in the Pokemon universe? At this point, it's just fucking all white noise to me. Oh. Hey, like, seriously, well, how fucked is the Pokemon universe's economy if children can easily become millionaires? Well, it kind of just implies that their currency is one that has more units compared to value. Yeah. Not only that, but the fact that they have two different currencies, too, like they have League Points, which all you have to do to get League Points is commit battling with, like, League members. Commit or... battling. Shut up. Or sell Pokemon parts from Pokemon you have battled and assumedly killed. But you also have to use the League Points to make uh, TMs, so the, the League Points are necessary to have in this universe. I see. My nose is so fucking stuffy. Oh, there's the bright. Bright. Bird, bird be bird. gone for so long. Oh, fuck off. Bird, 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 b
Yippee! Yippee! Yay! Yippee! Okay, so you have to read the code that I sent to you out to me because I'm a dumbass. What? Oh, I still have it in here, a set code. Yeah. 2698. Uh huh. 4201. Oh, okay, yeah. I almost remembered it, yeah. It has both of the meme numbers in it. Uh, yeah, that's the point. Okay, I'm going. I'm trading. I'm, yeah, I'm searching for a trade partner. <laughs> Yay! Bright, okay, when I send you this Pokemon, I want you to, uh, besides looking at the name, I also want you to check its moves. Okay? Okay. Oh, I'm just gonna send an app one. <laughs> yeah. Yay! <laughs> more salt in the wound that dragon has still not gotten a shiny app one. I'm trying yeah, to breed for say. a pink penguin now, so haha, <laughs> get fucked. That just means you failed getting a shiny Applin. Shut up. Also hit A. <laughs> oh yeah, this was on my list. Yeah, hit A. Oh. It's a black whale. This is the second one I've gotten, by the way. I was trying to look for you know the little knockoff Godzilla baby? I was trying to get the shiny for that, and then this one spawned outside the cave, and I was like, hey, that's kind of a fucked up whale-looking thing. I interacted with it, and it turned out to be shiny. But I want you, not not only just look at the name, look look at the moves. Look, just look at, look at the moves. Oh, Jesus. It's important. Uh, well, its name is D-Class. Yep, I, I, you got it. You got it. Dear God, if you have like a fucked up moves according to the D class, I swear, Dragon. Nah, it's just that uh, the D class has been overly anesthetized. <laughs> oh my God, <laughs> it's only moves amnesia. <laughs> yeah, fun fact: you can make your Pokemon forget all of its moves besides one. It has so, it had solid moves. I made it only no amnesia. That is so fucked. I mean, look at that face. Is that not the face of something that just has forgotten all connections to reality? <laughs> it's shiny when it evolves. It's really fucking good. Oh, ten yeah. out of ten recommend. Also, Hatchet, you know how I told you that my character has a negation power to eventually learn? Yeah. I decided to take that power away and replace it with something kind of cooler. Oh, yeah. Because if I had both, they would be overpowered. Yeah. And we don't want that. Like, characters have to have some sort of limit. Yeah. Like, even with the character I'm working on, uh, I specifically d am designing a character from the get-go to be overpowered but in the sense of meaning to comment on their lack of responsibility with how they use that power and then they end up limiting themselves rather than directly being limited one of the main villains force. one of the main villains for my story that hopefully i'll one day fucking finish uh is she is the best summary of her character is she is French, and whether she knows it or not, is a fascist. Yeah. Because, like, okay, so the thing is, so when she was born, uh, before she was born, she was prophesized to kill her grandpa, who is the god of chaos and shit. Um, so she was prophesized to kill her grandpa. But the thing is, is so she was always raised to believe, uh, like, you know, have this giant responsibility on herself. Um, but the thing is, it turns out that uh, she is incredibly easy co co to control. And seeing as one way that uh, her grandpa can control people is by taking one of their eyes, and she has three, or had three, and now she has two. Uh, yeah, it didn't turn out well. 
I see. I think I'll have enough picks for buy this many. Silver pick. How many? I did think you I buy? think we're I think we're starting to understand why you're fucking just... broke. Yeah, Bright, do you do you want me to like give you some money? Cause I am a millionaire. I can give you some money. No, fuck you. <laughs> okay, damn, Jesus, fuck. <laughs> You're like like you're like an you're like a very angry seagull. Like you're you're like you're like a seagull that refuses to eat french fries off the ground. I will only have french fries out of the <laughs> container. <laughs> I will not debase myself to eat the french fries off the ground. Thank you very much. We do you perhaps have a spot of Earl Grey tea? Why do you sound British? <laughs> That's the point, young man. <laughs> Get with the Times Dragon. What? I'm what? I'm the youngest person here. I have almost lived seventeen winters, or lived through twice. Uh, not twenty-seven. Jesus, seventeen. I I have lived through three thousand nine hundred thirty-five winters. L plus ratio plus you fell off plus. I, I existed before Christ. I need to find the encounter. Damn! So you really know what that twig looked like, huh? How it goes. <laughs> that that's not what that means. I don't even think the thing I said was a sentence. I mean, it was a sentence, it was just a dumb one. Well, do you know what that twig looked like? <sighs> no. <laughs> no. Just because I existed before Christ does not mean I actually saw Christ. Counting power, ghost. Thank you, Jesus Christ. I finally did it. Use 999 of my silver picks. You can actually buy, there's a bunch of ones you could buy. My favorite is you can buy no, one that I didn't is in the shape of a star. I hate how you have to hold it instead of just click it. Because now I just lost the potato salad. Right, actually, fun fact. You can make, uh, when you're in the, a union circle, you can make a sandwich with people. Uh, and it makes a really long sandwich. If you have, like, four people at the <laughs> picnic making a sandwich. There was this one, uh, there's this one group that made a, uh, so you can make an entire sandwich full of bacon. But the thing is, in this game, the bacon is, like, really girthy and, like, thick and makes a really weird juicy sound. Right. Oh, and they made a sandwich oh. completely filled with bacon, and you can only imagine the sound that them placing the meat onto oh. the sandwich but sounded look like. Look how beautiful my sandwich is. Oh, never mind. Oh yeah, look how beautiful it is. Oh, uh, well, what uh, is this animation? <laughs> We're all getting high <laughs> off my sandwich. It's obviously peak perfection, and Wait. it's obviously... Uh, years of hard work by a billionaire company. What do Wait, you, what I'm do you confused. Want? How did Bramble Gast eat? They don't have a metal. Yeah, Bramble Gast? Well, uh, I... Uh, How dare uh, you say that Bramble Gast can't eat? Go fuck yourself. Wait. Red potato salad. Encounter power ghost. Encountering power ghost. Why did it give me encountering power dragon? Well, make another sandwich. I think Dragon, it was because I messed up the potato salad. Yeah, probably. Dragon, did you have something to do with this? No. The potato salad. That, that looks like a really you not shitty potato. That looks like a really shitty potato salad. It's like all clumped up, and you can move oh, it, it all at like, once. It looks like it looks like rotten coleslaw. <laughs> I I hope whoever invented coleslaw fucking explodes. I hate coleslaw. It's it's nasty. They're dead. 
good. There are, That's where like, they belong. Like, it's, it's been around since at least the 16th century, as good. far as I know. I'm glad they're dead. Very gross. Oh yeah, my sandwich looks yeah. so beautiful. <laughs> it looks as beautiful lopsided. as you are, right? Wow. I, I can't see the sandwich. God. I feel sorry for your Pokemon. I'm pretty oh, sure we're about to go to the drug trip. I'm pretty sure what Bright is doing right now to her Pokemon is uh, counts as animal cruelty. What the fuck, dragon? Am I wrong? <laughs> yes! Kinda. No. Fuck Just you. a little bit. Fuck you. Child, Eat things shit. are not- things are not the way you say they are just because you say it. Encountering power wrong. ghost. Okay, so I'm gonna make it- make it again, and then we'll go for pal sand. Why- you don't need to make another sandwich. You just make it, and it has the encounter rate that you want. Oh, so. I just elect I just electrocuted a man so so much that his head exploded. That's kind of a skill issue on his part, not gonna lie. I mean yeah. Alright, so now I got more of a ghost encounter power rate. And I'm not seeing a single sandy guest. Okay, there it is. They're very uh picky boys, bright they have standards. They're, they're not gonna let any orphan that eats sand off the ground encounter them, okay? You gotta prove it yourself that you're not a toddler that shovels sand into her mouth. Well, considering the fact that Bright's not a toddler, I think that's pretty easily... Okay, now there's a ton of pal sand. <laughs> Bright, do you shovel sand into your mouth? No. Uh, are we sure? Bright. I'm pretty sure. What the fuck is I, I wrong just with you? It, I, I, Bright, I just looked it up, and what year were you born? 2000. Yeah, I looked it up. Uh, apparently, they have actually, uh, like, amount of sand in Virginia has went down since Wait, your what? birth. Fuck, no, not so, that much. So, I think you, I think you have been eating sand. What the fuck is wrong with you, dragon? Several and things. Is, and this is why scientific literacy needs to be worked on here in America. Fuck you. I am science. Wait, yeah. I've literally heard a flat earther say that before. <laughs> <laughs> I, did, I did say I am a scientist. I said I am science. There's a difference. Yeah. Well... I, I guess I guess it's a tiny bit different the way that they said it was uh we are the new science attack uh, them well I'm not new science I am science you are the concept of science you are the process uh-huh I am the scientific method that's kind of lame <laughs> Be being being a method. That's all you are? Well, technically, when I was born, my birth giver was on method, but it wasn't, uh, it was missing the OD, so that's fine. Oh, for fuck's sake. <laughs> I don't actually know if that's true. I'm pretty sure that's true. It wasn't I mean, that bad. Based, upon, based upon everything we know, it wouldn't be too surprising at this point. It wouldn't be far-fetched. Actually, talking about far-fetched, why isn't far-fetched in this game? Because fuck it you. Fuck you. Farfetch? What? There's a Pokemon called Fa Farfetch, and it's a oh. bird of the week. Oh, uh, okay. So it's a Therna, or I guess M U Y Doofinch birds. Um. <laughs> Why is your name hey. uh, M U Y Doofinch birds? Hi. Hi, Derna. Uh. Okay, right. You're doing all right. Oh yeah, I probably either have a cold or allergy thing. I don't know. Okay. I 
actually oh my one thing gosh. that I oh. When it rains the sandy gas to melt. Oh poor babies. We're they like eat children. I don't care. <laughs> what Why are you we attacking the slowpoke? Fuck the slowpoke. Why are you attacking the shadows? Go fuck the Are you forgetting that Gyarados is literally made out of pure rage? <laughs> you need to put that thing on a leash. <laughs> just a lot of murdering spree. But, fun, fun fact, uh, one of my favorite fun facts, is they actually changed the shiny for Magikarp in this game, and it actually looks golden. Like, it's made out of gold. It's really good. Put in the shiny. Damn it, despawned. Mm -hmm. I fucking hate the rain. Fuck off, rain. God damn it. Yes, attack the sandy gas. I really, because the, the fact that they're planning on updating and changing things for this game, I really hope that they make it where we... shinies don't uh, despawn. Because a lot of people have accidentally lost shinies because they despawned. Well, it looks like we got. And went on another murdering spree on another Pokemon. You really need to, like, put that thing on a leash. Uh, you, what, you ended up biting the bullet and doing auto battles? Yeah. It's a lot harder for the counter, because I have to watch every single one to make sure. Why did you kill your child? <laughs> <laughs> your child. What you, and the Silas Arc just fell what off the, the mountain. He just fell off the mountain. And, and God, was like, no. Please, I'll have a fuck train that the, thing. Christ. The fucking, the fucking motorcycle lep, reptile just slowly slides <laughs> down the cliff and then immediately gets killed by a dragon. Mm hmm. Yes, we couldn't tell Adurna I have a shiny counter on my stream now. Uh, I can't tell I'm not on your stream thing. <laughs> That's fine. But actually, it's a fun fact. So someone did the math, and when you have the shiny charm and encounter encounter slash shiny or sparkle chance uh, through level three and you're in an outbreak, the odds go from, like, you know, with the usual odds, to, uh, like, a, like, 163. It's incredibly mm. broken. And a lot of people have had, like, change- because uh, if you change your date on your Switch, you could also get, like, uh, outbreaks that you want. Because the, the, the outbreaks in this game are determined on the dates. Mm. And just so ate a crab. Oh. I like and how Sandy Gas is spawning and dying at the exact same time. Because <laughs> of the right, rain. Right, I think what you're doing is cruel and unusual punishment. Hey, they came out of the sand. I have no... nothing about this. This isn't even punishment. This is just... fucking... Murder? Yeah, I would say the actual name, but... Twitch. Homicide? The larger homicide. Wait, right, look at those birds. Wait, go go, go! look at the birds. Look at the birds, wait. Look what? up. What? I thought one of those... One of those looks weird. I guess. That red one! That red one! That's a shiny! Is it? Oh, yeah. Shit, sure is. Holy shit! Oh, that's so cool. Tiny but bird. I, I mean, I would like to see it more, but the, the screen cuts off. Angle right? weird, yeah. <laughs> Wait, right. Will Holy this be shit, your... look at that. Besides the one that the child sent you, will this be your first shiny? I think this is her third. Yeah, this is my oh, third. Because okay. I had the Glamora and, and Dee Dee. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I still find that funny. Like, this, the second I turn around, there was a shiny Glamora. <laughs> Yeah, I forgot about that. Right, can you name this thing, uh, can you name this thing Bright? No. Oh, damn. Well, it's going into the Pokeball. Yippee! Yippee! 
Yeah, one thing I'm gonna try and do, it's probably gonna take forever, but I'll do a shiny dex if I can. Look hey, at that, that one shiny. Long ass time. That's why I'm having to do this on my night shifts, but, uh, narcolepsy. <laughs> mm. Mm. Electric bird. What do you wish to name it? There. Just take two letters off its name. It didn't even Kilo water. Kilo water. <laughs> but yeah, I saw that bird and I was like, wait, there's something wrong with that bird. Why is that bird pink? And then you too bad you can't. Too bad you can't call it red bitch. <laughs> well, she, you, you know the name of her ditto, so hey, maybe. Penguin? Uh huh. I'm gonna send you some things, and it since it's not since it's meh. this is a little bit of context for why I changed my name. Why am we I were, like just talking brain? about it? It's not bad. No, I didn't mean to do that. God damn it! There we go. Of all the people in this chat, the person you should be the least concerned about sending you something is Adurna. Why am I staring at N's ass? <laughs> yeah. Nah, the... honestly, I am the Wait, person you should be DM? least afraid of. Yeah, I sent it in DMs. It hasn't loaded for me. Wait, N, oh, no, no. Is, what are you still... doing? <laughs> N's got oh. another killing spree. There it is. Oh. N, what the fuck is wrong with you? <laughs> oh, that's wrong. Mm-hmm. You know, a lot of people say I'm that N, uh, that do... one of the... oh. there, there are theorists who oh, believe go ahead. that uh, Doofenshmirtz is Phineas's father because they have the same head shape. No. <laughs> no. 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 If I remember correctly, though, uh, Phineas's mom and Doofenshmirtz did have a thing, like, when they were growing up. Well, they but had, was... yeah, they had a date. But, like, like, yeah, no, Phineas is too young for that to have happened. I was gonna, yeah. I was gonna make a joke, Candace but the maybe. child's here. Well, let's be real. It's kind of crazy how fucking, um, like, Doofenshmirtz's daughter even exists. Looking at Doofenshmirtz. And the particular feature he yeah. has. And stop killing the other oh, Pokemon I'm not nose? going for. Yeah. <laughs> and... yeah. Actually, a joke that I can't well, believe like... Disney let pass. Okay. So do you remember uh, how? Okay, so Doofenshmirtz he's going on like uh, his his poor history with Geralt, right? Do you remember how did Disney let the? Oh, but she broke up with me for a guy with larger fingers. Do you rem do you remember that joke? Oh dear God! Oh, I can't dear believe God. they let that that they let that pass. That's an actual joke in the show, and I can't believe that they actually allowed that. Like it's crazy. But also, real talk, child, are you body shaming Doofenshmirtz? How dare you? I was, no, I was making, I, it's a joke I can't explain on stream, but it's, if you, okay, oh, yeah, if you listen. yeah, I know, but I mean, like, before His that. nose. His nose. No, I'm not shaming him, no! I mean the nose. You were uh, saying context. that, you were saying that it makes no sense that he's had a child because of how he because, looks. Because, no, ugh, it's, ugh, I can't explain it, but it's not, it's, it's, it's. Uh, it's Dragon not his looks. It's a, body... a certain. Uh, a, 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 it's, it's it. his nose. God. Well, okay. I was I was gonna ask if it was like a if it was like a joke about like how, it's a joke about his nose um, and how like uh, genetics works. No, it's a joke about his nose like... specifically. The the context is look up the song Squidward's Nose by Cupcake. That's the that's the reference. That's. N what? Why would that exist in the Phineas and Ferb? It's not universe? in the Phineas and Ferb universe, but it is the context to the joke that I, I am trying to say, but I cannot Let's explain, see. as I will be yelled at. Fair. It's NSFW. 
Yes. If there are any children in stream, do not look up that video. <laughs> yes, Dragon will be punished later. Dragon is a pretty like normal looking dude though. Dragon will be forced to fight me one on one in Mortal Kombat. I'm not body shaming Doofenshmirtz. Dr Dragon, the ultimate body shamist. He's a normal looking guy. <laughs> Phineas, on the other hand, actually, talking about Fucking fucked up Dorito relationships. Head. Yeah. Actually, talking about fucked up to relationships in Phineas and Ferb, how the fuck did Ferb get with, I think her name's Vanessa? It's Doofish yeah. Fred's daughter. The age gap is I fucking mean, wild. I mean, how much of an age gap it would there be there? I think she was in a, uh, almost close she to was an adult. In, she was in Candace's class. And Ferb is the younger brother of Candace by like a few years. Yeah. It's very strange, especially since earlier on, before the finale, they make a joke like some dude tries to hit on Vanessa, and Doofenshmirtz goes, "She's only like I think 17. She's only 17," and like fucking zaps him to the no, she, she was 16. Oh yeah, 16. She was 16. He, he um, goes, "She's 16." Okay. I think Ferb might have been older than Phineas slightly, because, well, Ferb was uh, adopted, I think, if I remember correctly. Yeah. Yeah. He might have been older than Phineas, and Phineas was like around 12. What's yeah. weird about so that is that Ferb, Ferb probably like 14 or 13. What's yeah. weird about like, that? If it's 14 and 16, that's eh. Yeah. It's so like, it's weird. Yeah. It's 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 kind of just I don't know. It's kind of weird yeah. of what's, all things. What's weird about Ferb is that Ferb actually looks like the father. Like they got like the same nose shape. I think. Wait, what? I think. I don't know. I haven't seen the show in a long time. Oh yeah. I mean, you you mean their dad? Yeah. I think he was actually uh like oh yeah actually if I remember correctly he might have actually just been like the dad's child from another marriage another parent yeah because or something so yeah so i think it might yeah i just popped a girl's but they head like, like a grape. Oh. So, so like I... they like adopted fur because like fur was his kid and like maybe the his old partner like that like either died or would ask him to like take him in. Yep. Don't you know that a lot of American marriages in fifty percent end up in divorce? The funniest part is Ferb's dad is uh, well, British. Um. Yeah, and Ferb's dad is British. Like, uh, Candace's family has a British dad and a American, wait, yeah, an American, like, mother. Can, can the game let me see the damn palace, the Sandy Gas's name? No. Fuck it's, you. it's not letting me see their name, so I can't attack them. God damn it, Magikarp. Kill the child. And of course, Kill. Magikarp's on the, <laughs> Kill. on the beach. Kill. 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 That's not killing. What the fuck, right? They're not ki making I in. I don't think you're close enough. No, I was. I was like really almost near them, and it still Close wouldn't let them. me do it. I just electrocuted a man so hard that his body split in half. That's just and the Jesus usual. Stop. That and was probably uh, okay, Sandy Gath. If for a second it looked like he was about to attack that couple at the I know. The bench. I, know. I don't think Ben likes yeah. straight people. 
<laughs> and no, oh my stop God. killing random Pokemon. You know what? I think the issue is that N has spent way too much time on... Oh, killing on... the Fomantis. I think N has spent way too much time on the subreddit, Are the Straits Okay? <laughs> no, he's just sp spent too much time on Reddit in general. Probably. <laughs> yeah, that makes a bit more sense. It, the bookworm says N has had enough of society. He wants to burn everything down. N is in his Joker arc. <laughs> Shiny! Two Wait, girls can oh kiss. God. Two girls can Don't kiss. Everyone calls them Don't besties. eat your children. <laughs> but the moment I kiss my homies, good night. Society. Society calls me gay. Oh my god. That's a serious fright. <laughs> says bookworm. <laughs> We live in a society where it's for some reason unacceptable for me to commit murder. Also, Bright, check how much time you have left on that sandwich. Uh, you hit the left button. Left button. Th there's multiple left buttons. D-pad. 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 Left. No, right, 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 right. I'm a dumbass. Right. I just, oh I my just, god. I just popped Predator's head like a grape. Yay! I like how we're trying to see what sandwiches oh and I god. saw Garrett, uh, I saw N just murdering people behind me. <laughs> huh? You really need to put that damn thing on a leash. <laughs> <laughs> or make it eat seven orphans. That does, what, what the fuck? No, what the fuck? <laughs> That's It'll cruel on you. It's obviously hungry. That's cruel on you. Wait, is that shiny? Or is that weird? Oh wait, no, go forward. Oh, wait, nope, never mind. It's, it's it, it, and killed it. <laughs> okay, it's not shiny because uh, in auto battle they won't kill shinies. They actually clarified that, and I fucking love the fact that they clar clarified that. They will not kill shinies, which is how people have been shiny hunting for shiny dittos and shiny Zora in Zora Arc. And shiny your moms and dads. Well, Sandy Gas does eat children, so he probably ate some orphans at some point. <laughs> this uh, yeah. oh, oh my god. That's shiny not the same too. thing as feeding and those orphans. <laughs> Dude, uh, what would the shiny orphan look like? Oh my god, oh my we're god. not having this conversation. <laughs> Especially since or Jerry <laughs> clarified it. <laughs> and we're not wait, what, that wait back. what does that mean? Uh, don't worry about it. No, wait, I actually want to know what would that. <laughs> uh, everyone, is it bad? everyone, is it this bad? is a friend. Yes. This is a. Everyone, this is a friendly reminder that orphans are not Pokemon. <laughs> All right. Dragon. Basically, Jerry said, uh, is the reason why Palestine is black color because they eat black children? Oh, oh wait, oh, no. yeah. I... Wait, I remember that. Yeah, I remember, I remember it now. Oh, God. I don't think that's how that works, but... Damn, the war on drugs is he here in uh, Parmesan as well. Yeah, a country based off of Spain. My god, she's going after his own children and eating them. And He's hungry. Jesus. I mean, they're not his children. They're just random magic card. You don't know how, how much she... No, so, never so, mind. <laughs> never mind. So those are you orphans, know, then. You don't know the fish's spawn rate? I will harm you. Joke's on you, bitch. I'm already sick, so I my body's harming itself. No, it's that. No, that's not how that works. Fuck you. If you're sick, then something outside of your body is harming you. The only way your body Why? would be harming itself is if you either had a a form of cancer or some kind of autoimmune disorder. Why did you give me a sickness? 
What? Well, it's something on the outside causing my body harm, and you threatened to harm me, so why did you make me sick? That's not... Something causing That's you harm does not equal sickness. Do you not understand the difference between a square and a rectangle? Well, technically, rectangles are two squares. No, what? No, they're not. What the fuck is your... All rectangles are squares, but not all squares are rectangles. Yeah, that. Man, god damn it. <laughs> Kill the dog. <laughs> Wait, no. Yeah. Wait, yeah. no, it's backwards. Wait, no, you said it backwards. It's it's all squares are rectangles, but not all rectangles are squares. Anyway, um I was taught I was taught the true way of all all squares. Alright, had shit, Bokom has said two things. Never all right. Oh, well, actually, it's three. Uh, those those magic cards are weak. Never going to be able to evolve, and N is putting them out of their misery. Is oh. the two things. Oh and my god. Then Bookworm oh. says technically a square is rectangle. Exactly. Well, yeah, that's the point. Well, okay. Yeah, a square, a square is a rectangle. A okay. Re a square Penguin. is a rectangle. Penguin. A rectangle is not a square. Uh -huh. Penguin. A rectangle is not a square. Yep. If it's a square. Is defined by being a rectangle. Uh, equal di equal distant on every like every line, like on every uh what, what's it called? Yeah, every uh side. Yeah, every side is equal on a square. It's the same. Well, That's why it's called. A... Yeah. Well, a rectangle is literally any shape with four right angles, generally speaking. No, right. two parallel lines is how a rectangle is. Yeah. Uh, per yeah, parallel round. Right. I think you might have to get N's stomach pumped. Because he's just been eating sand. He's fine. <laughs> well, I, I, I don't think he is. Well, you also, also forgot you got children bones. Turn, turn. What? Turn your camera. Look at the bird. I don't I'm checking that bird. Is it shiny? No. No. I'm not gonna get a second one out of nowhere, dragon. I mean, that is kind of how shiny hunting works. That bird does something fucked up, doesn't it? Oh god! <laughs> and no. Oh. <laughs> and it's going on another killing spree. Mmm, poultry. Okay, no, it's not shiny. <laughs> there, there's a clarification. That thing is so hungry. <laughs> it is so hungry for death. <laughs> I just electrocuted a man so hard. He split that... in half? No, more than that. His entire lower body separated into five parts. What? Below his waist. Oh no, it was just three parts. Basically, it, his legs are left behind, but the entire below waist part of the torso is just obliterated. Mm. Describing loin it loin. further might be TOS. Boing loins. What? It's boing loins. I'm too tired for this. In. You don't know Stop the wise it. words. Oh god, that small bird is dead. You don't know the wise words of Ice King? Boing uh. Boing? No? No? Bird. I'm oh no. Bird. Well, I'm about to see a genocide happen. No, Jesus don't Christ. say that, Bright. Oh god damn it. <laughs> I mean that is uh, what and she's also presenting. this and also no that's not how that works. Homicide. This would just be yeah, like this would just be large homicide. All right, he's uh, yeah, he's just doing that to the sandy gas. So a hate crime? No. No. What the fuck's wrong with you? Several things. I don't think N has the capacity to c 
commit crimes based solely upon or even partially upon the nature or the mm -hmm. a, a protected class of the things that he's attacking. I think he just has a general hatred for all things. He's one of those edge lords on Twitter that's like, I don't care about any lives. I want everyone dead. Oh god, he's Aaron Yeager. <laughs> oh fuck. Actually, did you see what I put in dub post? Did you see what I put in dub post? Let me go look. I I also put something in dub post a while ago that Dragon reacted to. <laughs> I don't know how to feel. Why is why is why is she a dog from a toddler show? I mean, it's cute. There's like I... literally no distinguishing features of Mikasa on this dog except for the scarf. I mean, God damn it, N. I think she's a German Shepherd specifically. And learn language. Have you become too eloquent? Do your thoughts and feelings of ever feelings effortlessly effort exit your mouth in a delightful prose? I am Bigman Beefus, and I want to help you just disappear inside a self-made prison of violence and fear. Learn these <laughs> techniques: tortured just... screaming, panicked <laughs> whimpering, pitiful wailing, and many more. Okay, how do you think that that squid child eats the cake that I give them? How do you think they eat the cake? Because they're always crying. That squid and then child? Eat. Yeah, I put it. It's the thing. I it's it, it, it's their, their the cake picture. Oh, that. How does how do they eat? They I, have a mouth. I, I don't fucking know. They have mouth. But they always- they are always crying. So I think that the cake would be soggy. Okay. I think- I think the slamming their face into the cake is more realistic, honestly. Because I feel like they would do that. But also, they're not accurate to actual squids because their mouth is near their eyes. When in all actuality, uh, squids have beaks. And the beaks are in the middle of where their tentacles are. And they eat- they eat there. The, the lizard motorcycle just wanted to take a nice day on the beach, just come down here and immediately murders them. We really need to have an intervention for Anna at this right. point. Right, your your giant fish does not discriminate dis, dis, discriminate the bizarre. <laughs> you good? Discriminate. A, a, a sick dragon is even more incoherent than normal. Look, I, I, I have to feel better by tomorrow because we have a Christmas party for my D&D &D group tomorrow and I want to make brownies and yeah, I have a $20 uh, Steam card that I have to give away. My grandpa bought it and I don't want him, I don't want it to go to waste. Okay, so here's- No, here's, I'm not giving it to you. Here's the plan. No. Here's the plan. No. Here's the plan. Uh-uh. Wait, that one has encounter power two for ghosts, right? Wait, go down. Yeah, see? Uh, yeah. Encounter power. Yeah, I didn't that one. see that. Yeah, let's do that okay. one. Okay, child. Listen. Mm -hmm. Listen. Mm -hmm. You've got horseshoe crabs around where you live, right? Yes. Okay, so go to the beach. No. And give the card to a horseshoe crab. I don't think, it. I don't mean to discriminate against the horseshoe crabs, but I don't think horseshoe crabs can be gamers. Wow. Hey, Hedge, <laughs> how do you feel about this meat? I, what the, I... Or I not, you aren't we're, putting it on correctly. We're not having this discussion. It's fine. Right? That's a lot of meat to put in your mouth, right? Dragon. <laughs> no, it fell off. <laughs> No shit, it fell off. Are you looking at what you're putting it onto? I had to put all this on. Also, Bright, you don't have to put the top piece of bread on. You can fling it to the side, so you can make the sandwich look worse. And I'm being 100% serious. Like, it, it, it <laughs> won't come back. <laughs> there we go. 
It's beautiful. All done. <laughs> it's a master. <laughs> Look at the steak. <laughs> I feel like Armin's gonna walk up, see that sandwich, and just punch you in the boob. Armin? Armin. Armin. Argon. Uh, okay, Argon. Oh, okay. Argon is gonna see that sandwich, look at you, and then punch you in the boob. Yeah, I was about to say, I'm still thinking Attack on Titan. I'm <laughs> fairly certain Armin hasn't been Would demonstrated also punch you to be a connoisseur. Yeah, I, I highly doubt that Armin has been demonstrated to be a connoisseur of food. Wait, because you... I fucked up, so yeah, it's starting yeah, over. Yeah, because you messed one thing up, all oh, that sucks. Oh, make it again. Either way, Bright's gonna get punched in the boob by someone. If Are by no one else, to meet your then... fate? If by no one else, then Bright's gonna punch herself in the boob. <laughs> She's gonna look at herself in the mirror and just fucking punch herself in the boob. There. Now nothing's going diagonal. Do I actually have to put the bread on and make it have a counter power? No, the, uh, John still plays. I think that's his name. Uh, he he. Every time he shiny hunts, he just flings it to the side, and nothing bad happens. And he's like the master at all things Pokemon. Nothing bad happens. I promise. How is the meat phasing through the sausages? Don't question it. Don't, don't, don't question. No, that Never it. question. Listen to the government always. This is something the government wants you to believe. The no! Meat... God damn it! God damn it, Bright. It keeps falling off because it's way too much food. And you should put it on first. Or take reference from the image. I didn't even put the steak right on the f sandwich. Wait a second, that's how it's yeah, supposed to look on the rich, side? Right? Yeah. It's supposed to look like a fucking malformed abomination? Uh, hey, that's what I looked like when I was born. Fuck you. That's how we all looked when we were born. Good point. Yeah, bro, you fucked it up. God damn it, right? God damn it, right? I'm sorry, like, it's it's way too much food on one You're sandwich. a terrible cook. Hey, actually, you know what? You could use this as proof, though. If anyone tries to be misogynistic to you and tells you to go make a sandwich, you can show the gameplay of this and tell them that you're very bad at making sandwiches. It's just like, yeah, I'll make you a sandwich, but you're not going to be happy about it. Okay, so stack the hamburger onto that. No, stack it. Stack Stack right there, yeah. Yes. Okay. N now use mm -hmm. the flat meats. Right there, right there. Right. Okay, wow. potato salad. Use the potato oh, salad, put it on top of it. No. Oh, on top of what? Right. I, 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 Power right. of food. Look, all that matters is nothing falls off and that the bread doesn't have to go on top. So it, as long as everything stays on top or stays on the, the bottom piece of bread. Everything is fine. <laughs> there we go. Just making towers of food. There. <laughs> like they Please weird. never become a chef, right? If you can't awful. make a sandwich. There it goes. This Look, everything's awful. on. This is fucking awful. <laughs> everything's on, so it's good. What are you? An idiot sandwich. Oh my sandwich. gosh, it's beautiful. <laughs> I I think if I saw that thing, I think I would actually throw up. That is not a sandwich. That is a that is a child. What? What? <laughs> Explain. Wait, I just realized the sausages look like those things that you find in a pot in Resident Evil Seven. Oh God! God, now I can't unsee it. <laughs> oh no. There we Why go. are you feeding that to your Pokemon? <laughs> there we go, Bright. It's all, it's all good. I didn't realize that at first, but then I was like, yeah, that, that looks like it. Your Pokemon don't need to get fucking infested with the mold. 
yummy, the mold. I love mold, right? It's my favorite food. Feed, feed me mold. My body can handle mo mold. I, I crave mean, yeah, mold. Like, cheese is literally mold. No, I mean, like, I actual mold. mold. Well, certain cheese type. Cheese is actual mold. <laughs> no, what I mean... Alright, what I mean by that is the mold you're not supposed to eat. So black mold? Well, I don't know what mold it is. When you say the when you say the molds you're not supposed to eat, what is the differentiation between right. the molds that we do eat? All right. So basically, there's uh, apparently for a few days now I didn't notice it in the cup, but uh, there was mold buildup in my water bottle. Oh, you. And I drank it. Wait a minute. Right. And you're wondering why you're feeling sick? Yeah, and you, you, your blame get on your dog that you love so much. When in, in, in all possibility, it is the fact that you have been drinking mold. Why would, why would mold give me a respiratory? Mold's fucky. Because mold's fucking weird. It's a fungus. It's got spores. Yeah. But yeah, like I, I can consume mold and everything be fine. No, I don't think- no, I think not, you're gaslighting is not yourself. fine. And like, yes, oh, like, depending on the type of mold, it won't be deadly. But like, what's the point of that ob ob observation? Like, depending on the amount of bullets I fucking ingest, it won't be deadly. <laughs> but no, courses. but if I shoot you in the knee, you can't become an adventurer anymore. Damn. Well, corpse is so more more reason to eat it. Stop eating mold. Mm. Aww. Ah yes, I love murdering children. Am I going to be spared? No. Oh. Run. Because <laughs> you said that, oh. no. <laughs> Well then, get on I'm the nearest. Tissues. Get on the nearest boat. Get get on the nearest boat to to, to Cuba. Oh, that was when it was only children brought up. Well, not mold. Okay, never mind. <laughs> Thought that was the. But yeah, and it's not the first time that uh that I've eaten mold, and. Uh, I didn't get s no, no, there was actually this one time I've eaten mold and I did not get sick. Right? Okay. For one, it was when I had a sandwich at, like, a restaurant place. I, th I forgot what it was called, but it was, like, it, it, it shut down soon after I ate the sandwich there. But apparently there was a mold in the middle of the sandwich. I said, oh, this tastes weird. And I, I just finished it. And, uh, I didn't get sick. It was probably blue cheese. Right? Right? No. The only... The only right? thing I had on my sandwich was meat and bread. What the... So it was moldy bread? Probably. Right? Yeah. Was it... Did you... Uh, okay. Did you get sick, like, within, like, a week or two afterwards? No. Okay. My body can handle the mold. No. You, you're, you're sick right now. You're, <laughs> pray, you're sick right now. <laughs> what the fuck? So what? So you had the sandwich. The sandwich that you had ordered was literally only meat and bread. Yeah. For starters, that's such a boring sandwich. <laughs> True. But second, you're absolutely sure. At least it has some certain. cheese on there. Yeah, like second, you're absolutely positive there wasn't anything else on the sandwich. I don't like cheese on my sandwiches, so. Fair. Yeah, because when you're talking... Uh, culinary stuff, and you start talking about mold, basically the go-to that my brain goes to is blue cheese. 
because it's it's basically just extremely aged cheese, so it's pretty much just like it, it you can taste a very distinct moldy taste to it. It's very much an acquired taste. Why is the dolphin on the beach? Kill it. There's multiple dolphins on the beach. They're getting beached. No. I just checked my temperature. I have a nine. I am ninety nine point three uh, Fahrenheit. Yay. A low fever. It's better yeah, than one hundred and one. So you still have a fever. Actually, it's yeah. not a fever <clears throat> for me. Yeah. Right. right. You're uh, incredibly no, wait, fever. Hold on. No, I, I've I had my temperature checked. They they said my normal temperature range is from uh, 98.5 to 99.5. So. Yeah, huh. but you're also incredibly mine is from, fucked up. Yeah. Mine is, mine is 97 to 98. So yeah, so that wouldn't be a high Mine's, temperature for me. <laughs> around right, my body is typically up. lower temperature. I feel like 97 to 98 is pretty average. I mean, in terms of like the general population, yeah. mine is 96 to 97. I mean, is anything about me normal, Dragon? Not really. <laughs> so why are you surprised about my fucking temperature? Oh. <laughs> what is normal body temperature, and how do I check that? Uh, usually a doctor would tell you. When you I have not been to the doctors yeah. in two years, so... Like, no, because you want to know the weird thing is my temperature, uh... So my mom, or I guess birthday giver, my birth giver broke down the door to the bathroom. Well, she opened it. I didn't have it locked. But, uh, she was like, okay, I have to check your temperature so that when you go to... I was in the shower. And she was like, oh, I have to check your temperature if you go to school tomorrow. Which is weird, because temperatures change overnight. I don't know. My family's weird. Uh, and it was 96 when I was in the shower. You have it? Oh, Pokemon has been to a doctor since 18. Uh. Oh. How old is Pokemon? Ancient? Since 2018? 2018? No, I think when they were. They were 18. <laughs> But yeah, the standard body temperature is basically just pretty pretty similar time because like I think Bookworm is like around twenty twenty, like around my age. Well, How since I was eighteen, actually? seven years ago, says Bookworm. Oh damn! Seven years ago? Okay, so that was 25. yeah. Jesus, Bookworm's old. Jesus, dragon. Okay, not that old, but like compared to everyone. <laughs> like, that's uh, everyone, mean. Like, yeah, everyone here is old. Hey, that means ha hey, that means te by technicality, bookworm knows things that we don't. So that's how bookworm became penguin? a millionaire. Yeah. Penguin. Uh -huh. Everyone in this voice chat knows stuff you don't, and you know <laughs> stuff you. we don't. Everyone yeah, knows I different things. Well, jokes on you. I know everything. I know your birth certificate identification. No. Yeah. No, you don't. I oh. know the numbers. No, you don't. I I know them. Oh, catch it. Where where was I? Where where was my birthplace? Kentucky. Um, he had it. <laughs> I've literally. That's not even close. Oh my, it's my god! State I've dragon. literally stated this multiple times. God damn it, you fucking crab! Kill it. Okay, and I want you to eat it so I can talk to Hatchet. Oh yeah, and, and what's what's my uh, birth name? What's my uh, dead name? Uh, Why well, I, I don't want to guess your dead name. Go ahead. So in other uh, words, you uh, don't. Andrew. What? That's that's book. That, you literally <laughs> that's book's name. <laughs> <laughs> Guessing bookworms in front <laughs> Oops. Sorry, bookworm. Oh my god. Oh my god, what if bookworm was actually born in Kentucky? How fucking <laughs> funny would that be? <laughs> bookworm, where were you born? 
<laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Why are you asking this question? Hey, hey, hey. Okay, the thing is, it would be against TOS if Bookworm was under the age of 18, but it has been clarified that Bookworm is 25, so this is completely... It's fine with TOS. Anyway, like I was uh, trying to say, uh, Hatchet, there was actually something confirmed by the gas gas fruit. When I remember when I talked about that. Mm. Yeah, apparently, anything in the periodic table you can create with the gas gas fruit. Anything uh, in the periodic table. Uh, I can I want think to of make a nitrogen. I can think it's of a solids. few things. There's that... solids and liquids that are on the periodic table. Well, yeah, but this basically means that you can make any gaseous form of those. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So I guess that makes me wonder, does uranium retain its radioactive properties in a gaseous form? I don't know, oh. but that's terrifying. Actually, come to think of it, it probably would. Yeah, it probably would upon... because, this, uh, because the chemical composition would still be the same. Yeah, and terrifying. like... And, uh, like, for instance, like, the first thing that I think of is Corium, being, mm -hmm. uh, if y'all don't know, Corium is arguably the most dangerous substance on the planet. It's basically the result of nuclear fuel melting down oh and my. becoming liquidated. Damn. It, like, if, you, if, you've, if you've heard of the elephant's foot at Chernobyl, that's... That's what it's made of. Oh, Jesus. It was just... Corium is basically just nuclear fuel that melts down and then melts into and gets mixed with sediments and a whole bunch of other minerals. It's extremely radioactive and hard to deal with because it maintains its own radioactivity and heat inside of itself. Yeah, it's... Like, like I said, it's some of the most dangerous stuff on Earth. And, and yet, yeah, like, and even though it's like, in that case, probably uranium, specifically in Chernobyl, the uranium would have been melted down to a liquid form. It was still obviously highly radioactive to the point that mm. like a deadly dose of radiation uh, from the elephant's foot when it was first formed would have been like standing next to it for about two seconds. Um. Yeah, this the Corium is like genuinely terrifying. Like if there there is nothing that has made me more uh kind of like curious at writing SCP than concept of what Corium is. Actually, is there actually... a Corium SCP? I feel like there would be. On the I topic mean, of energy, maybe. But, uh... and SCPs, I think it was a weird fever dream I had. But I had a dream that... He... Okay, so here's the idea for the SCP. So, it, this SCP was discovered uh, when a random person took his daughter, his sick daughter, to go like see penguins. And he told like the people working at the zoo, Hey, I want to see the penguins up close and personal with my daughter because like she's really sick. And her favorite animal is penguins, so I, we, we want to see the penguins up close. And so the person goes like, oh yeah, yeah, and takes them into like an underground facility type thing. And there's these penguins uh, running around. And so uh, so the daughter goes up and like grabs with the penguins, but it turns into a plushie. But like, and there's all these tubes connected to these penguins running around. And so, like, she puts the, the, the penguin back, and it turns back into a penguin. And so, like, the, the dad makes a weird, like, a the uh, forum on it, and no one believes him. But, you know, the SCP Foundation being the SCP Foundation uh, finds the zoo, the zoo and, uh, after several tests, finds uh, the underground facility where, like, one of the doctors had to take, like, a young-looking D-class and say, Hey, this is my kid. We want to see the penguins up close and manage to convince the employees to let them see the penguins. And that's how they got the penguins. But the penguins are stuck in the zoo and they, they power the zoo. And they okay. can't be taken oh, away from the specific area because they'll be turned into plushies. 
Okay, wait a minute. Back up. A young D-class? A young-looking D-class. So, like, an adult D-class that looks like a teenager. Like, just young-looking, uh, not actually being, okay. like, young. Yeah, like okay. a young face. Like, you know, like, baby face? Like that. Yeah, okay. They have tested children and the foundation. Yeah. Well, yeah, true. Have, do I but have generally to? speaking, I'm willing to guess that those children aren't D-class. Oh, there was this one person who was put to death because he, because you know, zero five three didn't get killed by a six eight two or anything. They didn't fight. Yeah, yeah, this this researcher decided what what would we, what would happen if we put an actual child in there? They did oh. it twice. Oh no! Oh, and then no. they were thrown in there <laughs> by the O five. <laughs> they were like, "What the fuck is wrong with you?" <laughs> yeah, that's. Bro, just, just no. But anyway, it, uh, that thing about the gas, gas fruit, that's what really pisses me off about that fruit user. Because they were a scientist. They didn't think about doing that. And they got beaten by a person who has the power of rubber. Oh, uh, what the fuck. <laughs> you could, oh my god. With that, uh, with that power. You could feasibly fucking just spontaneously give your enemy an acute, like, deadly dosage of radiation within seconds. And you I'll used it diarrhea. that ineffective. Well, that's probably going to come with the radiation poisoning. <laughs> the symptoms of radiation poisoning is basically literally anything you can think of. Give, because... the, give your enemy explosive diarrhea. Yeah, because radiation poisoning is basically just your entire body's uh, biological structure getting hammered to bits by really fast-moving particles. It's, it's, it's a mess. I, I still hold that Wait. radiation poisoning you look is different. probably <gasps> the worst. You look different! Yes, yes, yes! Get over it, bitch! I, I still hold that radiation poisoning is probably the worst way to die. Look, look what Bright has. Bright has the racist, the, the racist uh, ghost. Oh no. Okay, Bright, this is ghost type. 268 encounters. Use quick ball, use quick ball. I don't have any quick balls. Fuck. You should have saved before encountering it. Oh, it's fine, not mine. But. It's a ghost type, it might have Hex, and that will insta-kill Oh, it. and I do have quick balls. <laughs> yeah, well, now it won't work, because you have already used a turn. Yeah. Yeah, see? <laughs> oh, fuck. Okay, it's fine. Damn, too. I'm so happy. But, or use a dive ball. <laughs> Why? I don't know. Yeah, these balls aren't working. <laughs> this can be taken out of context. <laughs> Catch. Well. Catch? No. This is Are actually really name? fast for a shiny encounter, like 268. It's fucking Xenomorph is ripping me to shreds. Right, are you gonna name this thing, uh, Racist? Oh, there it is, that's a crit capture. There we are. Racist Sand. No, no, no. Racism I Sand. System Sand. I don't Racist know why Sand. You, you would think I would do such a thing. Oh, no, no. <laughs> God damn it. Someone please, someone please screenshot this. Wait, I, I can screenshot it. Uh, I want you to, like, look. <laughs> I want to at Jiri in this when you're when you're done. I wonder if and... it'll let it, though. Racist. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. Okay, hit check summary or see summary. Hit that. Thank you. See Thank you. Summary. <laughs> okay, I'm going to at Jiri now. <laughs> Wait, where's it? Oh yeah, there's its name. Yep. God damn it. <laughs> so for like 268, that's actually 
really good. It's a ground and a ghost. I I couldn't have guessed that it was ground and ghost type. I just There we are. Fury just... knows. I'm just gonna decrease Oh wait, I can just hold it down. And Boop. Oh wait, that's negative. Whoops. <laughs> Bit too much. <laughs> Apparently with the shiny counter thing you can go to negative number. <laughs> Oh, what the Imagine fuck? you're so unlucky, the number goes to fucking negatives. Alright, so. We're gonna change this picture. To. Camera up? Why would I go to camera up? Or Numal. Numal? Camera up has a black shiny. That's further down the line. Fair. Alright, so let's go here, go here, browse, you, open, done, there we go. Got a small live. That will probably be a lot faster. <laughs> I'm so happy. I got a palace sand. I got palace, uh, I got this one. I got You got shiny. racist sand. I like him. He's cute. Congratulations, Bright. You have now been cancelled. <laughs> See, this little shit? This little shit's cancelling you. <laughs> yeah, this child. On. Um, you know. can't run away. No, you ran. How did you run away from the cancelling? No. Ah. You ran away from Twitter. You can't catch me if I'm on a wall. <laughs> Who are you, Elon? Can't cancel me if I don't use your shit site. <laughs> huh. But yeah. All right. So let's. Oh, I can't. I can't access the save button when I'm on a wall. <laughs> and that just broke the shiny chain. So happy I got my shiny sandy guest. You got your racist sand. Yippee! I love the Yay. fact. I love the fact that Jason in Mortal Kombat is so strong that one of his brutalities is him just shoulder checking a person hard enough for their head to go flying. Wow. Like the the like the body just stays right where it's at and the head just flies off screen. Actually, what oh. is Hound Doom shiny? I don't know. I think it's turned slightly blue. Find a shiny Pikachu. No, I don't oh, like this shiny. Oh god, I fucking hate. Oh yeah, it's a blue shiny. I find a shiny oh, right. Gardevoir. Why? Why would you want that? Why? Why? Why would you particularly um, want? Want that. Oh, we all know why. Oh, God damn it. The main, well, least, I mean, no, I the reason I would want Bright to find a shiny God of War is because there's no shiny little punny to find. At but, least it's humanoid. I mean, I could go for something that's not humanoid. Uh uh. Gross. Drag again. No shaming. Smallive! Damn, you just. Fucking, be, just just fucking screwing over all the furries out there, huh? Wait. <laughs> look, tell me, look at me straight in my eyes. Say with full your full chest out that that olive right there is attractive. What the fuck is wrong with you? What? Exactly, <laughs> exactly. Do you? Think There's that... only a certain extent on which furries are, can hold defend. Up. Hold up, hold up. Do you think that humanoid refers to anything that isn't a plant? No. Then what? Then you're, in other words, you're just making a point that is completely irrelevant. Olive. Olive. Yep. 
Okay, yeah. so apparently oh, the olive Pokemon lives in nice, olive nice, fields. Nice. My nice, nice fucking, nice fucking, fucking misdirection, child. Nice argument, Senator. Too bad I made it the fuck up. Thank you. Right, why are you going? Right here. It's right there, right? Okay. It's right fucking. It's right fucking there, right? Shut up. You're. You are certainly a crayon in the box, aren't you? Also, question the uh, the S the SCP the Pokemon that's inside your phone is it native to this region? Rotom, yeah. Yeah. Okay. I was about to say because, like, if it's not native to the region, then that could be really fucked because all it takes is that thing somehow getting out of your phone and you've got an invasive species. Oh no, your Rotom choose the appliances that they haunt. Oh, okay. That thing can choose to leave whenever it wants. Actually, oh, if I remember actually correctly, Namona is... Uh, you can contact and get whatever- wait. Namona's- okay. uh, one of Namona's parents actually, uh, invented the Rotom phone. From up above, it kind of looked like it had a black top, so I thought, oh, already off the bat. But no. Alright. Little green boy. Oh, yeah, right. How long were you playing to sleep? Till 2 a.m., like every night thing. Okay. If I can get a second shiny, that would be awesome. Oh, yeah, I, sh I should do the sandwiches. Shouldn't I? <laughs> God damn it. There's so many fucking buttons to get off the fucking bike. God damn it. I'm used to fucking DS controls, not the fucking Switch. Even though I've played this for hours on end. God damn it. I keep hitting the wrong shit. <laughs> that whole thing's gonna be clipped about me trying to get to the picnic. Pick a dick basket. Okay, what the fuck did you just say, child? Pick a nick basket. Okay, because the way you said it, it sounded like you said something very different. No. Like the first time. Mm, my nose hurt. No one cares. Fuck you. Eat shit. Damn. That's kind of fucking rude to say to your child. <laughs> yeah. Damn. I don't give a fuck. Mom, my nose hurts. Fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> fuck you. Punches you in the nose. I am a good parent. Definitely <laughs> better. Uh, that's better parenting than good portion of the parenting I received growing up. It's called tough love, bitch. Overcome your sinus issues with pain. Look, technically if you break my nose and you put it back, technically my sinuses will be gone. No. You can actually have no. your sinus removed if you want. What? Why would I yeah, cause want you? That? You can literally do that. It's a procedure. Why would I want that? The sinuses are crucial for survival. Literally, what the fuck? Actually, I don't. It's the main, like it's the main way that we breathe. Well, you right, can are remove you it. Using it for something else? No, I I know you can remove it. I've seen the thing where you can remove your sinus if you want it. Hold on, I I'm look looking it up. up. Oh, okay. Yeah. Like at this point, this is just medically and like this is just medically assisted auto homicide. Yeah. Why is Splatoon two? Endoscopic sinus surgery is a procedure to remove blockages and treat other problems with the sinus using endoscope. Oh. That's not removing the. Oh wait, sinuses. can you live without a sinuses? Like an appendix, like an appendix, sinuses is not a vital organ. So yes, you can remove it. One can that... do just fine without a sinus, says it. 
It says it clears day. So yes, you can remove it. Yes. I think I just broke hatchet. Let's be hard. It's not. Uh, let's be. <laughs> Let's be hard. Okay, yeah. Just, just leave at this point. Just go. <laughs> There's no coming back from what I just said. Uh, let's be real. Let's be real. It's not that hard to break hatchet. I won't even try to deny that. You people are very good at pushing my buttons. In the funnest way possible. Either way, I'll, I'll send it to you later, Bookworm. Because, uh. Either way, I'll I'm respond to this new. This new information that Bright has given me by simply saying, What does a bird know? Fuck you. What does a bird know about human sign? Uh, that's bacon? <laughs> What the fuck? Yeah, that's the that's what I meant. Someone made an entire tie a uh, entire tower uh, uh, of just bacon. Right? Do you hear the sound that it's making? No, I don't have my second headset on. Why? It's a very squishy sound. Yeah, bro. Especially when it slaps against the other bacon. Well, it's a bit too late now. Put in the pin. There we go. Yeah, it's you beautiful. see. Un yeah, you see. Unfortunately, Bright's other headset was in a conspicuous box that, for some reason, is missing. Yeah, now I'm using a crappy one. <laughs> that you can't turn the volume down for. Oh, why? Oh God, that is. I need it. I need to get a new headset. I think I'm going to be getting one here, like, close to Christmas. There it is. Beautiful. Encounter power, grass. Level 2. Yep. Yippee! Honestly, I would- I'm less judgmental of people that find Lupani and Gardevoir attractive than people that find Vaporeon attractive. Different strokes Vaporeon is strokes. just a dog. That's just a dog. That's just- uh, Okay. Like, that's pretty common within Furrydom. I- it, it's on four legs, it's not even bipedal. It's not even yeah. like- And? Yeah, that's just... Your point is... There are limits. It's an attraction to a fictional animal. Get over it. Okay. Well, There's I don't like the fact that a small live drops oil. How do you... Har do you grab the olive so... The small live so hard that it just... It just squirts oil? Yes. Have you not heard of olive oil? Oh, what? what? You ha have you not heard of olive oil? Yeah, but like, this is a living olive. This is a living olive. They it drop has... olive oil. Don't question if I actually it. Remember it if I actually remember correctly, I think they have a specific gland that you can grab out that is full of oil. That's, I, I'm pretty sure that's what they're, they're, they're grabbing out of the Pokemon, but still, it's kind of fucked up. Alright, when I make sandwiches again, I'll put my second headset on. God damn it, I'm not. Yay. Oh, oh wait, it didn't count. Good. Oh, sleep in olive oil. Kill it. No. Oh. <laughs> Good. Lemon's like, nope. Okay, now. <laughs> Lemon <Yuck>. hesitated. <laughs> Lemon is like, this is so fucking cute. Don't tell me to kill it. I don't want to. I'm guessing that there's no shiny for the starters. No, you no, can get is. shiny starters. You can't get it at okay. the beginning, but you you can you can breed for them. Oh, okay, fair. Then I heavily encourage you to get the shiny of the of the weed cat. Why? Because 
um, because I want to see the shiny of that final evolution. It's really for, boring. Uh, it just turns reasons. the eyes. It just turns the eyes blue and like a slightly different shade of green. I don't care. I want to. I want to see that. You want to see the flamboyant cat? I want to see the flamboyant fanboy cat. Uh huh. Wait, the Pokemon was just right there, and then it just disappeared. Yeah, it grabbed it for you with your little weak human arms. You useless fuck. Jesus, dragon. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look, it's a horn. Kill. I told oh. it to kill. Actually, I like the fact that in this game, since the Pokemon can pick up items for you, that kind of insinuates that the animals can be used for accessibility. Uh, the Pokemon can be used for accessibility, and I actually kind of like that. I think that's pretty cool. Yeah. But also, your Pokemon character is a useless fuck. Oh, again, with this, such kindness in your heart. Your Pokemon character, not you, your Pokemon character. <laughs> hey, child. Uh, yeah? Your Pokemon character will inevitably die in a bonfire. Joke's on you, motherfucker. My character's already dead. Fuck. <laughs> Actually, d wait, you don't know, you don't know about the, you don't know about the Ghost Chrome XY, do you? Ghost Chrome XY? Girl. No, you don't know Ghost Girl in Pokemon X and Y. Look I it up. I feel like I've probably seen it. Look it up. Look it up on YouTube. Oh. Ghost Girl X and Y film. Well, again, I don't it's have... never been explained. They don't have like, the browser thing open, they can't do it. Okay, I'll explain. So, there's this one building in the main city in X and Y, where if you go to the building uh, and you take the elevator, it triggers an event where you step out of the elevator. A girl, which uh, like mainly the ghost type trainer girl that you see around the region, it's this girl, and she takes one step, and it's the walking animation, but it freezes, so she just floats around with the one step forward animation. Mm -hmm. She walks around you, stops in front of you, staring away from you, and says, No, you're not the one. And then goes off screen, and when you go to the area where she walked off screen, she isn't there. You can and find it has her never been hacking. referenced again, and it has yeah. never been explained. You can find her through hacking, though. Yeah, but that's hacking, not in-game. But it's never been explained who she's looking for, and she's never shown up again. Also in X and Y, there's a confirmed trans woman, so that's pretty cool. I still haven't I... seen it, because, like, Nintendo likes to reference Missing No somewhere in their games. I have not seen them anywhere in this fucking game, and I'm upset. Well, like a poster or something. But... There's a trans girl in X and Y, and I think that's pretty cool. Yeah, like, X and Y, like, Missy No just was sitting in a dark alley that you can't go into. It just sits Wait, really? there. Yeah, he, it's there. It just sits there. Wait, it's, I like, gotta look that faded, up. and it's hard to see, but it's there. Anyway, I'm gonna go get coffee. No. I have to actually head out in a few minutes, but... Oh, mm. shit, yeah, you're right. Yeah. Actually, it's in a store. It's in a store, actually. Oh, in a store. Oh, okay. Yeah, you. Can, it's a clothing store. Oh, I probably think of black and white. Yeah. No, it was in an. It was in an alley. Yeah. But it's yeah, like it's it's just so. Stores. It's so freaky. Like you just. Oh shit. You just go look in the dark alley and you just see Missing Note just staring at you. <laughs> 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 it's it's like the it's it's like hero bride in minecraft is it better to like missing no better than uh hero bride no i like i like missing no better also i can't what you're referring to with the alleyway and uh, I've seen it in one Pokemon game. I don't know what it, which one it was, but I remember seeing Missing No in like a fucking alley. And I think I'm it. Looking at 
I remember it. Yeah, I can't find it. I remember seeing that shit, and I was freaked out about it. I was like, wait, what the fuck? I think it actually is black and white. Because they had a bunch of alleys in black and white, didn't they? Uh, I'm not sure. Oh, I'm gonna go to sleep. Good night, Bright, and good luck. Right. Keep your eyes open for any shinies that aren't the one you're looking for. Especially nice. Hop Ep, uh... Or, yeah, hop -ip. I saw someone miss a shiny hop -ip because they thought it was the second evolution, and it wasn't, so look out for shiny hop -ip. Uh, well, Good luck. Lemon's just murdering every hop -ip they see. They just do yeah. not like hop -ip. Yeah. Good luck. Alright, thank you. Wait, dragon's gone. We can now say sexual things. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> Bonk brain says book <laughs> Yeah. Yeah. It's just me alone with you, chat. It's just bookworm at the moment. <laughs> uh, I'm just feeding my Garchomp, so there's nothing wrong with what I'm doing. I'm just feeding them. I'm just feeding them. You know, Le lemon sharks have to feed on olives. Don't you know that? That's their basic diet. Feeding lemon pure olives. <laughs> I feel like Hatch is going to kill me. Why did you kill the cricket tot, Lemon? I wonder if I'll have another 200 counter rate this time. Lemon, stop killing them. They're not even what we're going after, Lemon. keep going on towards the search for getting a shiny small live oh here's a bunch of them kill kill them all not one must survive bring out your shiny leader Is there more over here? 
can't tell. Yep, there is. Stop killing the diglets, lemon. Damn it, Lemon. <laughs> hey, yes. Anyway, Pokemon, I'm correct about uh, lemon sharks only eating lemon, uh, not lemons, um, uh, olives as a basic diet. I. I mean, there's underground olive gardens. That makes sense. <laughs> Good enough for me, lol. <laughs> yes, expert fish scientist person. <laughs> yep, all of our exists in the ground. Hundred and one Dalmatians. It's a dog movie. That is all. God damn it, Lemon. You're going a lot faster. God damn it, Lemon. <laughs> Wait, wait, wait a minute, Lemon. Do you mind explaining that? What did you do? explaining that for me because I still don't understand. I need explanations. <laughs> Sorry, I didn't notice. It just a giant white platform appeared under Lemon and then they teleported right next to me. Any explanation for that? Magic. <laughs> Man, Lemon's a hungry boy. Oh. 
I didn't even get near you. I'm way far away. How did you... Fuck off. Oh. Died. <laughs> Bitch. <laughs> A small group of olives. Die. Sort of, it's like every 200 I get a shiny. That's gonna be insane. <laughs> Bookworm, give me, give me your shiny magic powers and give me another shiny. <laughs> Stop killing the bees, Lemon. We need the bees. Lemon, no. I mean, stop being America. Lemon just does not like bees or any other living thing since they keep murdering everything they see. I mean, there are sharks, that makes sense. Sharks don't do that. You don't know. There could be killer sharks. They just right? murder everything. Sharks don't do that. You don't know that. Ah uh, yes, I love spreading misinfo about sharks on the internet. <laughs> Should go forward. Yes, there you go. Lemon has difficulties going by gates. That's good to know. So, which way did you, sir? It's literally right there. You can see it from over here. It's that big ass building right there. How are you that fucking blind? I just made fun of an old man for no fucking reason. But 
compliment. Yes, eat the eat the olives. Eat the olives. The the lumen shark's natural food source. Oh, uh, hey, Hatchet, uh, um, so, you know how I have Lemon out, right? Yeah. Uh, I've been going on a tangent that lemon sh all Lemon Sharks eat are olives, and there's an olive garden under the sea. Oh, for fuck's sake. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, Lemon Sharks? Yeah. God damn it, he's not even actually a Lemon Shark. <laughs> <laughs> oh, so right where he's being... Species is for sharks. Oh fuck! How dare you? What was Bright saying? Bright was saying that like that sh sharks were like. What did you say again? You'll never know. <laughs> wait, wait, wait! Now I have it in my head—an idea of uh. Uh, I would probably need pictures from you again, but now I have it in my head. An idea for a meme for the fish deck being it's just a picture of Lemon with a speech bubble saying, My handler is Sharksist. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> well, like... <clears throat> Yeah, Bright was saying that like sharks are uh like like are killers and like murder like everything around them. Pretty much. Right. So. Right. Are you doing a heckin' shark misinfo? No. I will hurt you. Yes, she is. Right. 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 Real talk. Real talk. Mm -hmm. Fuck you. I hope all of your favorite frogs get eaten by sharks. <laughs> How would that even happen? We can make it happen. <laughs> and you know what? They would deserve it for being loosely associated with you. All of their little amphibious lives would be on your head. What about the mountain chickens, huh? Just gonna dump them all into a fucking... We're, we're gonna find one of the most ineffectual sharks, like most basal shark. We're gonna get it like a, a whole tank full of silk sh silky sharks. Just dump all of the remaining of them into the tank. This is what happens if you spread shark misinfo. We will kill your frogs. See? As you can see, people, Hatchet believes in making frogs go extinct? No, I believe in making Bright pay for her actions by making her sad. But what if I have the entire population of mountain chickens? Then I'll just get some fucking land sharks. Mountain chickens are critically endangered. Okay. So are sharks, and you're fucking endangering <laughs> them by spreading shark misinfo. <laughs> Seems like an even trade to me. <laughs> Not to mention the fact that I can't imagine that uh, mountain chickens are as important to their ecosystem as sharks are to theirs. I think they take care of a lot of the bad insects in their area. I mean, yeah, but commonly, uh, like, let's just be frank. Amphibian populations don't make as big of an impact on, uh, quote unquote, bad insect populations as do just having dragonflies. Dragonflies? What do you mean? Yeah, dragonflies. 
dragonflies tend to hunt down primarily uh, mosquitoes and other pest insects. Oh. And they do it extremely effectively. Like, dra if you didn't know, dragonflies are basically the most, like, probably the best flyers on the planet. I think the most fucked up thing I heard about uh, flyers is is from this bird, the hummingbird. Like, if it stops moving, it can die. Yeah. <laughs> wait, then, wait a minute. How does it sleep? I'm not sure. <laughs> if it stops moving, doesn't it? Die? I mean, it might just be misinfo, but like, I feel like I have heard that. Basically, the way that their circulatory system works is that for it to properly function, they have to constantly bat their wings. Ah. Uh. Someone they're sleeping, they're sitting on a, on a branch, constantly flapping their wings. <laughs> <laughs> now I kind of want to see that. <laughs> that would be kind of funny. <laughs> I mean, it's a hell of a trade-off to be one of the most inefficient but cool birds on the planet. Like, like they, they're the only birds that have full 360 degrees uh, flat maneuverability. But the trade-off is, is that they can literally get bodied by fucking praying mantises that are so weak. Yeah. I've seen, like, if you haven't, if you haven't seen that, look that up. Praying mantises will just straight up kill hummingbirds. Oh no, I've seen one kill a snake. A praying mantis kill a snake? Is it like a young one? No, like, they can, I mean, yeah, some of them can, like, literally kill a full-grown snake. <laughs> Jesus! <laughs> like, I would, I, like, I would first think, like, maybe something like a garter snake. No, because uh, like, uh, I saw one like in real life kill a full-grown black snake. Oh, what the fuck? How the? What the fuck are they putting in the praying mantises in Virginia? <laughs> what? From what I saw, what it did, it kind of like, I think it got like on top of it and stabbed its head a couple times. Okay, <laughs> just doing an anime, <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> the praying mantis anime. Yeah. Wait, attack on Titan, but the Titans are snakes, the people are praying mantis. <laughs> why do I picture that so well? That's why you'll be given these flesh pairing uh, arm blades. The only way to defeat the snakes is to cut out the nape of their neck. <laughs> <laughs> if you achieve that, they'll die and stay dead. Uh, there was actually one that uh, I also saw in real life that it got injured, but it killed uh, a male robin. Praying mantises are just fucking <laughs> insane. <laughs> like, they don't give a fuck. Like, they're one of the most just, I don't give a single shit about you insects on the planet. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Did I ever tell you about Steve, Hatchet? D Steve? Um, it's a prey mantis I saved, uh, that got put in a museum, but I think died, like, a year ago. But, um, Aww. um, basically, I, I don't know why, but some people put, uh, a prey mantis near a wop's nest or whatever. I guess they have a, a animal fight video. That's a dick move. Yeah, uh, the only damage to prey mantis sustained was that it got blinded. Oh. Yeah. Blind mantis. Uh, so I picked it up. I uh, took it to, like, this uh, bug part exhibit to this museum I know that's near me. Mm -hmm. 
and they put it with another Prey Mantis. Uh, the other Prey Mantis was also male, like they're both male. But instead yeah. of fighting, the other one was actually helping the Prey Mantis. Aww. So yeah, they were best buds, but like, Steve died a year ago. Yeah. They, they don't live long. Yeah. But yeah, that's the story of Steve. <laughs> we stand, Steve. Yeah. That's the one thing that still pisses me off, like, YouTube does not take them down. It's when people make videos where they force predators and prey to fight each other. Yeah. Like, Jesus Christ, YouTube. That's animal abuse. Yeah. <laughs> Just gotta fucking report and move on. There's genuinely nothing else we can do at that point. Yeah, the most, uh, biggest one is when- is with fish and reptiles that mainly get popular. Yeah. I think there was, like, one where they forced one piranha to fight a barracuda. And we can already tell how that went. <laughs> what's the- what's the point? Okay, first- okay, are you sure it's a barracuda? I think- I think it was. I- uh, like- are you sure it wasn't a musky? Maybe. Or like a, I, I know a it was like it was, pike. I know it was like it was really long and had like serrated teeth. I think from what I saw in the video before I clicked off. Okay, cause if it's a barracuda, that's even worse because um, uh, barracuda are saltwater fish. Oh shit! It might and have not been a piranha. barracuda. And piranha are freshwater fish, so either the barracuda is in freshwater or the piranha is tossed into salt water. Oh my gosh, it's even worse. Which, to be fair, like, that's the thing. Like, if it's just, like, demonstrating, like, I don't know. In the case of a lot of fish, depending on the circumstances, you might be basically just feeding your pet fish. Um by, like, tossing in another type of fish into the tank. Yeah. But that's it just... It alive, that's so... Just, that's just weird. That's just... Uh... And technically, like, veterinarians say you're not supposed to feed your animals live... other live animals, because they can come with viruses and bacteria and shit. Yeah. Unless, like... Unless, like, the animals are bred specifically within captivity. Yeah. Like, that's a really common thing for reptile keepers to basically keep their own miniature colony of uh, mice. Yeah. So that they can feed their reptiles. Great uh, five alarm sandwich. Okay. <laughs> Wait, I passed it. Where's the legendary sandwich I need to make? Coffee. Just return this, the coffee to, to deal with the bullshit that we just talked about. <laughs> but yeah, back to uh, the thing about uh, lemon eating olives. I mean, you could, like, maybe, like, it, if we just, like, changed, like, retconned it so that Lemon is technically a bonnet head shark, then it would sort of work. Because bonnet heads are a species of hammerhead that are, like, eat, like, 70% of their diet as plants. Oh, I, I made the bitter sandwich. That's why it lasts for so long. I use my bitter... Uh, Herba Mystica. Whoops! Oh no. Oh yeah, not to mention there's the, uh... Like, let me just, like, the Bonnethead is by far my favorite species of Hammerhead. And it's like, 
the main motivating factor to me wanting to go to Florida at some point. Because, mm. as far as I know, they primarily live in the Everglades. Right. Humongo power grass. Humongo power? <laughs> what is humongo? <laughs> Humongous? Humongous. Um, among us? Shut up. Oh, yeah. Alright. So, here's the thing. I'm gonna explain this. Yes, I only had one meal today again. But this time, I used my money to get five guys fries with my burger, and I worked there, so I got the large fry, which can feed up to three to five people. So technically, I had probably about 3,200 calories, which is, I think, Jesus. over, which is over, I, I think, the maximum you're supposed to have a day. Isn't it? Well, it depends on what you're doing, but yeah, I think so. Yeah, so I had enough calories. But also, you're working at Five Guys now? No. When I oh. used to work there. Oh, when you used to work there. Yeah, okay. I know a lot of shit about that place. Interesting fact, the first Five Guys was, was actually built in Virginia. Cool. Yeah, they, they, they had you learn the history of Five Guys while watching a video before you could even work there. That's not fucking culty at all. <laughs> you want to work at our fucking fast food restaurant for pittance? Ah, well, first you've got to learn about our grand founding. You see, the founding fathers of the Five Guys Burgers and Fries was Mr. Schmerdy Schmerdy and Mr. Schmerdy Birdie. They revolutionized food consumption by, get this, Having five guys with burgers and fries. <laughs> I saw one really wholesome trans meme that was like, uh, mm -hmm. uh, that was like making a joke about five guys, uh, renaming itself to four guys burgers and fries because one of the guys transitioned to a girl. <laughs> okay, here's another power hatchet. Teen C power. Grass. What does that mean? I don't know what it means. Team C power? Yeah, it's teen, the word teen, and SY next to it. Okay. Trying to find the freaking grass one. Accounting power grass. I'm tired of getting beaten up. I'm getting kicked in the groin. Encounter power grass. Okay, so I need uh, tomatoes and apparently lobster. That's lobster? And, well, it's called great. Oh, no, crab, not lobster. Crab. Okay, great crab claw, makes more sense. Claw sandwich. Let me see if the ultimate one actually has crab. Okay, ultimate one is better. I also need the, a wasabi, I think. Ah. Uh. Go out, get crab, crab leg, tomato, and wasabi. Why does it look like Gardevoir keeps falling down tired? Because <laughs> oh, there's literally, she's literally sleeping. Okay. Good job, Hatchet. Oh, apparently there's an outbreak of the Pokemon I'm looking for, but I want to make it an even bigger outbreak by getting food. That sounds weird. 
<laughs> I'm going to spread a disease of a Pokemon by eating food. <laughs> Alright, so... I don't think they have what I need. No, you do not. Maybe you have it. Goodbye. Where's the wasabi? How is the every store I'm going to don't have what I need? Perhaps they're racist. What? <laughs> Where did you get that from? I will not be providing context at this time. I did not want to talk to the fucking cricket fucker. That's rare. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I can't talk to the shop owner. Mm. Hey, what's up here? Oh, that's actually kind of cute. Oh, It's very laggy butterflies. <laughs> <laughs> this game has some issues. Oh, this is where the gym is. Or not gym, the, the, the gym battle thing. Wee! Yeah, All what right. was this? The uh, electric gym or the grass gym? Bug. He, he oh, didn't... bug. <laughs> Alright, let's go over and get tomatoes, wasabi, and crab. Hey, Bright, who will win, Predator or Jason? Both. That's not how Mortal Kombat works, you one... fuckhead. <laughs> one win... Uh, you gotta win by hugging. And no longer fighting. That's not no. That's not an option. <laughs> the only option here is violence. <laughs> Isn't there like a uh? Didn't they make like an Easter egg where you don't kill each other at the end or something like that in a Mortal Kombat game? I mean, I'm not sure. I remember in the previous game to Mortal Kombat X. I still I need to actually start playing Mortal Kombat 11, but die tangent um there is a type of fa fatality that everyone can do which is called a babality which you basically uh. just turn your enemy into a screaming toddler <laughs> and then that's it that's all that that's all that happens they don't kill the toddler which is probably for the best <laughs> i mean who why wouldn't you want to kill a baby right <laughs> Seek therapy. Ah, tomatoes. Here we go. Finally. Let me make... I get 50 of you. Wait, it's $100 per tomato. What the... F <laughs> yeah, so they, they definitely have a very... <laughs> like, a, a, a very different currency. <laughs> yeah. Just imagine having to pay hundred dollars per, per per tomato slice. Either that, <laughs> or they have crippling inflation right now. Cherry tomatoes are twenty dollars more. <laughs> Why are cherry tomatoes more expensive? <laughs> oh wait, so that that must be it because the tomato tomato is already sliced. So you're getting less tomato. Maybe. Maybe. I don't know. I still need to find wasabi and uh, lobster. Oh, oh not catch lobster, a crab. lobster. Go catch a crab. I'm not sure if this is a restaurant or a place where you can buy shit. Eh, it's a place by uh, it's a restaurant. It's a restaurant. Oh yeah, you know that one person that comes by every so often? 
that, that, that was new. Person. That was that new. One. That uh, freak, freaked out when we misgendered or whatever. Oh yeah, them. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, they didn't. Yeah, they they grew very concerned when I saw the nightbot thing. The nightbot thing? About the abuse of hell thing. Oh no. <laughs> they did. They had no context. Yeah. 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 Which I felt so bad. I mean, you shouldn't feel bad there. Yeah, I mean, the thing is, like, I, I explained, but, like, it's hard to explain everything within ten minutes. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know, it's almost going to take five hours to explain. It all started when I was fucking bored. <laughs> the first thing my mom said to me when I came out the room oh, wow. was... The first thing my mom said to me when I came out the room was, Oh my god, get that thing out of here. <laughs> my father's only response might actually to me... Be accurate. <laughs> my father might only... actually yeah, be slightly accurate to Bright's parents. My father's first response to seeing me was, Wow, I thought it'd be uglier. Oh my god. At the age of 12, I began showing symptoms of scoliosis. I don't know what I'm even talking about anymore. I can tell. At the age of 5, my mother took me into into her bedroom and said, Hey child, I'm going to throw knives at you. I can't find wasabi anywhere over here, so we're going to go to the main place. I hope we find some fucking wasabi. And that's why I had my first hospitalization. When I was first hospitalized, the doctors asked, Why is there a knife in your son's chest? And my mother simply said, Well, he wasn't good enough at dodging. <laughs> Jesus Christ! <laughs> Wait, how oh. are you even alive? <laughs> this isn't... That, that didn't actually happen right. I know, I, I'm just like, in the character's way, how do you live? At the age of seven, my father took me camping. He taught me how to fish, and when we fished, he fucking threw me in the lake. It was freezing cold. I still am missing three toes. <laughs> what the fuck? Oh my god. Um, I love this voice you're doing, though, Hatch. Yeah, yeah. I'm going for like a, uh, like the, um, the radio announcer from the 20s vibe. What's bad is, is I can totally picture that voice being in Bioshock. <laughs> well, I mean, that's literally the era that it's kind of meant to go by, right? Yeah. Like, early, early 1900s radio broadcaster stuff. Right. Oh, did you know this, Hatchet? Um, For the machines, the creator of Bioshock voice acts those machines. Cool. Yeah. I don't know anything about Bioshock. Yeah, but the machines where you buy stuff from are the literal creator of the game. Hmm. I, I thought that was pretty damn cool. <laughs> I didn't expect that. <laughs> it's usually not really seen as much. When I was nine, I was in my elementary school class and my father showed up to the school carrying a bag of dog feces. In okay, the back I, of dog. <laughs> I was thinking something else for a minute there, and I need to take a minute. <laughs> Wait, what do you think I was gonna say? What do you think has been happening with schools recently? Oh no! <laughs> oh no! No! I'm not going that direction. <laughs> That's what I was thinking. <laughs> That's why I, I said I need to take a minute. My father brought a paper bag full of dog feces to my homeroom classroom. 
He then took all of the dog feces out, threw it at me, and then ran away cackling like a maniac. <laughs> <laughs> At the age of 11, my mother stole my pet dog. That is all. <laughs> Enough said. I miss Bubbles. <laughs> uh, oh my god. <laughs> if anyone has seen Bubbles, please contact me. <laughs> what is wrong with you? And now that I say that, I'm remembering at the age of 13, my mother gave me an odd tasting sandwich. Oh, uh, oh, oh no. The sandwich remind me but a little of bull. Oh my god. I think Bookworm just caught up to what I said. <laughs> Oh, I'm so sorry, Buckwire. <laughs> Why was that my immediate thought? I mean, it's kind of lodged in our cultural consciousness at this point. Uh, as wait, depressing as that is. Right immediately thinking I was going to go the route of a school shooter. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Like, I don't even blame you for that one. It's like, it's just kind of burrowed into our subconscious at this point. Like, yeah, we, like, yes, we live in America. People go shoot up our schools. This is just how things are now. As fucked as it is. The thing is, now I'm having a problem because I don't know. Where am I supposed to get this meat? Can you actually buy meat in Wasabi? Because I can't find it at any store I'm looking at. You could look it up. Fair, I can look it up. After I check this one last spot. Wait, is this the food place? Maybe? I can't tell. Here to buy. Nope, this is not food. <laughs> When I was at the young age of 14, and we were finally going through our sexual education class, my mother came into the class and started throwing beans at everybody. It was <laughs> really weird. <laughs> I don't think my mother knew what we were doing. I forgot to mention that when I was at the age of 8, my father took me to an amusement park. We rode the roller coaster again and again and again, and then I realized after 25 minutes that my father had abandoned me. What? I was forced to continue riding the roller coaster. I don't think my esophagus has ever been the same again. <laughs> this is such a dumb joke. It's just such a bad joke, but I find it so funny. Alright, so I'm looking it up right now. So keep okay. going with it, Hatchet. What? Keep going with what you're doing. <laughs> Oh, well, I'm currently getting... I, I am currently getting my balls busted in by a fit lady. <laughs> and not in the fun way. Oh, my God. Yeah. I was at the age of 16. My father encouraged me to go on a long pilgrimage out in the Alaskan Outback. The Alaskan Outback? What the fuck am I talking about? <laughs> Out in the wildernesses oh, of Alaska, I was given nothing but a fishing pole, a, a backpack full of wet clothes, and a dog. I never saw my father again. Ah, okay. <laughs> I need to find a keystone. 
They sell wasabi and a cloth stick. That's wait, the cloth stick is sweet and salty. Apparently to the Pokemon game. See. It is both sweet and salty. Oh, your clothes actually show it getting wet when it rains. I'd never noticed that before. Ah. Imagine that. There is water on your clothing. <laughs> what is my ca my character's like expressionless, but they're going down like they're... No, not water. Just expressionless, not even changing their face. <laughs> Jesus Christ, that's horrifying. Yeah, your character has barely any capacity <laughs> to express emotion. That is horrifying. That's Arson Bakery, right? okay. Okay, I don't think Keese is over here. I know it's not over there. I have a feeling. Right. I was at the ripe age of two. My mother took me to an orphanage and left me there. But she ah. soon was asked to take me back because they did not want me. I gotta go near the VTuber. Then I can make some sandwiches. At the age of 35, I be I attempted to become a famous VTuber, and my mother came into my house and dumped a bucket of cold water on my PC. <laughs> I just imagine you just saying all this stuff at like a horse races thing. <laughs> and out in front is number five. Now let me continue telling you about my emotional dairy. <laughs> it is very crucial that everyone in the stadiums keep an eye on number two and the fact that I hate my mother. She's such a bitch. Uh, you have to. You have to like say like a. You, just, you have to say, like, a, um, <clears throat> you have to say, like, a funny, um, what does it call? Like, a funny horse name or something. <laughs> like, in it's... like, just, like, in between that, you're just like. <laughs> out, out there in front, we see Clomp Trump. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, is horseradish uh, two words or one word? I've generally only seen it be a compo compound word like that. Okay. Because I, I couldn't remember. Yeah, out there in front, it appears that there is a tight race between Clomp Tromp and horseradish. <laughs> Wait. I just read the description for the cloth steak, which is from a crab Pokemon. A very sweet and salty ingredient. It's a nutritious processed food made from a concentrate uh, derived from sh uh, shed cloth shells. So it's not even from cloth. It's from oh, the shed. That's just... Uh. <laughs> yeah. That sounds awful. <laughs> Hello there, young boy. Would you like to try the flavor of a lobster's claw? It's just the shell, though. I already ate the meat inside. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, what's this store? I will slurp oh, I up all in. of the lobster juices. <laughs> Alright, time to go back and murder the entire olive population. When I was at the age of 12, my father jumped into my bathtub and dumped a whole bunch of crayfish into it. God. I still have scars in particular places that only my wife has seen. <laughs> we can just have a whole stream and you just like talk <laughs> just like improvising, that. just yeah. improvising this bullshit and narrating yeah. what's happening yeah And ladies and gentlemen, today we're going to be watching one, the great Dr. Wright, construct a sandwich for his Pokemanes. <laughs> you have no idea how many people around where I live actually call Pokemon Pokemanes and Pokemen. 
<laughs> you have no idea. I see they've used the automatic sorter to put all of the uh, smaller ingredients on, and and we can see them expertly moving the clawfish, cl cloughs, cloth, those sticks over onto the bread. <laughs> Ah, see, they're equidistant, so far away from each other that you'll never be able to taste other things with them. Oh, and look how they expertly place lettuce in between the cloth, the cloth sticks. That's a that's one hell of a mouthful, mouthful, folks. And here we go. They're they're adding the tomato, just just as the recipe intended. This is this is Fuck. going. <laughs> oh, we. It appears I got that they have distracted. Have... It appears that they have dropped a tomato. That's unfortunate. They're going to lose some points there for that one. I was distracted by the voice. All right, see, they're adding the pebbles. And what did they do with that pegot? <laughs> and let's see what the score is added up to. I don't think this is going to look good. <laughs> <laughs> I want to. You're send... missing a tomato and the top of your sandwich, I sir. Kinda wanna, I kind of want. I kind of want to send this picture and at Gordon Ramsay. Because <laughs> <laughs> he does like respond to people when they do that. <laughs> That'd be so funny. You... Yeah. Okay, you need to do that like, like meat thing again. And then, and send that to Gordon Ramsay. <laughs> <clears throat> yeah, I need to do it again, because I fucked up the sandwich. Ah, the judges decided to uh, uh, help Aaron Bright cope with the feeling of complete and utter failure by saying that it was a tasty Dr. Bread original, rather than the sandwich they were actually <laughs> supposed to fucking make. I think I'll put the lobster <laughs> things on last, because everything else is pretty much flat. Ah, this time, let's see, they're going about a different strategy, adding the lettuce first. Very smart, very smart. You'd think that someone with half a brain would have done this the first time, but whatever. <laughs> the way I said that turned a little bit into Cindy. No! no. Oh, wait, no. Wait, it's oh. still technically oh. on. It's still technically on. It didn't disappear. Oh, oh, oh. we may have a technicality there, folks. Oh, oh, oh. Oh There's, my God, Breaker! The, the it's fine. Is starting. It's a, it's Everything's gonna, fine. Everything is a. Oh my God. Okay. It will not take me long to have a brain aneurysm at this point, folks. This is this is absolutely atrocious to watch. The cloth sticks are going on last. They're rolling all over the place, as you'd expect from such a lopsided piece of shit. No. no. God damn it. Oh. And there goes the tomato slice, and there goes the top of the bread. Okay, lettuce goes on last. Even though it says in the picture, lettuce goes on first. And as such, it appears that we have once again found another great Dr. Bright original, because we don't want to tell Dr. Bright that she's fucking bad. <laughs> wow, Hatchet. The judges are abnormally kind to the great Dr. Bright, but I am not. Wait, I just realized Bookworm's I think I'm message. I'm killing a Derna. Yeah, I just I just saw Bookworm's message right now. Did she flick the beans at you? <laughs> a Derna is dying. <laughs> and we're going for a third try, folks. Doctor Bright is very determined to actually prepare this sandwich properly. All right, let's get all the flat shit done out first. Uh. So let's throw in all the femboys. <laughs> ah, yes, femboys. I, I do appreciate femboys. We're going to be adding the tomatoes first. Um, great. Now my thought process has been thrown off by the great Dr. Bright, thanks to them mentioning femboy. <laughs> You're welcome. I would... Hmm. An interesting choice. I would have assumed that the lettuce would go on next, but... Whatever they think we'll do best, we we can't really know for sure until until the end of the sandwich and see whether or not the sandwich actually holds together this time. Ah, uh, now we've got the lettuce. Look how they ever so haphazardly drop the lettuce leaves onto the sandwich. 
The only thing is now the cloth sticks. My cat is sticking his butt in my face and it's rather distracting. <laughs> Festus is my new co-host. Say hi to the good folks at home, Festus. Yes! Now are they gonna put- Oh, we're gonna have to deduct points for not putting the top of the sandwich on the sandwich. That's <laughs> kind of what makes it a sandwich. <laughs> But you know That's what, this beautiful. is very, the, the, you know what, this is technically what the recipe said, so the dishes are probably going to be, again, be very lenient. I, I'm starting to believe that the great Dr. Bright may or may not have paid off the judges, but that is just a, <laughs> that is, uh, that, that is just my opinion to make it very clear. I have no definitive proof. I'm not saying that that is the case, but at this point, it seems rather odd that the judges continue to favor them so heavily, even though what they're making is absolute garbage. Alright, let's see. Level 2, level 2. Yeah, level 2! Oh, excuse me, folks. I like how Lemming just randomly swims in the air. Oh, <laughs> 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 Lemming, you good? Um, uh, yes, Festus. What do you have to say about the uh, current events on screen? Riveting commentary. Thank you. Thank you very much, Festus. Anyway, back to the previous conversation. At the age of 12, my mother came into my room in the middle of the night and spat in my face. That is all. Oh my god. At the age of seven, I distinctly remember one of my 24 siblings coming into my bedroom and punching me in the nads. Luckily, I would not hit puberty. It did not hurt as bad as it would eventually, but it was still insulting. My parents oh did my nothing gosh. except give them a blue medal. <laughs> when I was nine, my younger sibling decided to attempt to poison me using rat poison. However, they ended up eating their own sandwich and promptly die. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> my parents blamed me for the whole affair, but they could not prove it in a court, so I was not charged. Oh my god. At the age of 21, I first purchased a vacuum, and I may or may not have used this vacuum on my paint. <laughs> Oh my god. What the <laughs> fuck? I have just gotten word from our sponsors that they do not want me to continue that statement, so I will not be continuing that statement. <laughs> I need to be able to I need to be able to pay for my mother's debt. Lemon, stop killing the bees. At you're the not, age of You're not America, Lemon. At the age of five, my father attempted to sell me to the Costa Rican Mafia, but they decided that they did not want a little shit like me. Lemon hates bees, confirmed. At the age of nine, my parents threw a killer bee hive into my bedroom and then locked the door for 12 days. Jesus Christ. <laughs> At the age of 10, I slipped and fell on a rock. <laughs> that is all. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> that is all that happened, that trip. I, ha I still have a slight scar on my elbow, but that's about it. Lemon, no, not the bees! And here we see Dr. Bright committing war crimes against bees once again. Lemon, why? Ah, uh, yes, the, the poorly trained shark Lemon appears to be wanting to kill bees for no particular reason. The fact that the Lemon Shark is killing the bees reminds me of that one time my parents took me to... A hang gliding lesson, and then threw bees at me while I was hang gliding. Told you. 
Ah, hello you. too. <laughs> <laughs> I'm shiny hunting right now, Chew. I am current on the to counter that I am currently dying inside. That is why I don't sound very coherent. I am very exhausted. Why are you currently dying inside, Chew? I, uh, you know, I just, just now finished doing my schoolwork for the day. Um, I was surprised to learn that I just suddenly had seven assignments due today. Jesus. By the same time, didn't see it coming. But, uh, that was a nice little... Nice little surprise to get uh, 12 days, but wait. Sorry, no. It, no, wait, yeah, 12 days before Christmas, so that was nice. Um, I am currently running on three and a half hours of sleep. Go to bed, chew. No, I, I have earned my god-given right to stay up to play some video games so that I don't go insane. Hey, Chu, I want to tell you something interesting. Did you know that lemon sharks eat only olives and have an olive garden under the water? Please do not listen to the misinformation spread by one the great Dr. Bright. I'm too tired to listen. My, my brain is not active right now oh yeah and apparently bees too lemon lemon sharks eat bees i'm okay with that i hate bees why do you hate bees because bees suck they're incredibly important no, they don't and they're awesome they're incredibly important yes people they won't. tell me this they won't people tell me thank this. you People tell me this all the time, and they are more or less stating the obvious to me. I'm fully aware of the importance that bees have, but I don't have to like bees. I'm not telling you to like aware that bees won't hurt you. Like, I'm not telling you to like bees. I'm the most baffled. Like, yeah, I'm not telling. I'm not telling you to like bees. I'm baffled that you have a disdain for them. Hey. Yeah, mm -hmm. because they sting. Yeah, so does the flogging no. whip that you want to be hit with. The what? The flogging whip. I don't, Hatcher, I don't well, know what that is. Or maybe I do. You don't know do. what a like, flogger is? Well, if I do, I can't remember it because, reminder, I am running on three and a half hours of sleep. Plus... Yeah. Lots and lots of caffeine and sugar from ice cream. That's Fair. all that's got me going right now. Fair. A flogger is a type of whip that has a short handle and short tails that, and it has like a whole bunch of tails. That is a flogger. It is, oh. extremely, com it is extremely common in BDSM. Okay. Point being, like, many things that you like also sting. It's not a valid like justification. Penises. Also, also, Chew, you like claws and sharp teeth. It's just in. One tiny it's little electric... It's just in. One tiny little electric mouse has an issue with small bee stings, but is completely turned on by the fact that teeth and claws may dig into his flesh and cause him to bleed. I'm sleepy, but I'm not that sleepy. Nice try. Oh. I forgot... <laughs> I forgot what it's called, but there is a candy that you can buy that's, that's just honey. And has bees in the inside. Yeah, I've seen that. I've seen alcohol hey. that literally has um a cobra in it. Well, no, no. What the oh, fuck? Yeah, no. that's a thing. No, I I know that's a thing, but where the hell are you going to find this? 
I was just talking about the, um, the little bottles of alcohol that have, like, the, um, the, uh, the worm inside. Like, the little, uh, the, uh, worm thing the inside. tube worm? That, it, sure, I don't know what kind. I'm, I'm doing the best I can with what little brain function I have right now. If I'm hey. not mistaken, tube worms are parasitic. That does not sound very healthy. No, it's it's a it was a um uh hmm it it was it 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 was something I don't know it was something that that's that's the best you're gonna get it was something. Or was it? No, that that is literally the best that I can muster right now. Um, I I I it is taking everything I've got to keep my head up did, and not just slump. Did no one see that? No. Lemon twerked in front of the olive, then killed it. <laughs> I mean, that's one way to assert your dominance. <laughs> it's just in. There is a new website that I've been sent a link to. It is called uh, OnlyLemons.com. <laughs> <laughs> Only lemons. I don't like lemons either. Bulkorp says, uh, gotta give it a show before it goes. How considerate of lemon. Oh yeah, chew. Uh, I look at stream planning. Um, I would do that in just in ju just 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 a second. Is my exhaustion showing yet? No. Not at all. I just want to improve my gear really quick and then I'll uh, uh, I'll be right there all right let me take a look what's what's uh what what's what's happening you what's see the up? picture oh that yeah I already saw that <laughs> I was I, I'm too I'm too exhausted to react to it Basically, we called it that because Jiri said, <laughs> "Does that put oh, yeah. black children?" <laughs> yeah, I I know you you DM'd me. Yeah, J Jay said it's probably not a good idea to put it in quotes. Fair enough. It's just in. Racism is apparently triggering to some people. Who would have thunk it? <laughs> Why is my game so quiet? Don't worry about it. Is it the game is too quiet or is it that your ears are not properly functioning because you're running on three hours of sleep? I'll have you know. Well, actually, it's three and a half hours of sleep. Ah, congratulations. <laughs> I don't know if my voice just came through, but I do genuinely think I am starting to succumb to madness. Slowly. Madness is yes, but another- Yes, that is possible. Madness is but another form of brevity. I don't know what that word means. Neither do I. Alright. Time to kill some fish and steal their their unborn children. It's Let's just go. in. Chew is unethical. This is not the... a surprise. This is news to nobody. Ethics are over ethics are overrated. What's that dish that's just fish eggs? I forgot what they're called. It's called caviar. 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 Yeah, that's what Chew's doing. They're just making caviar. Oh no, Cav wait. 
They don't they don't eat the eggs, they use it for power. It's even worse. Wait, Jiri just responded to the damage. <laughs> hey. You get out of here. Oh, no one gave you Hi, permission Jerry. to make it rain. I'm oh, shiny no. hunting right now, and I finally got Jew. a shiny sandy guest. Jew, please the peach clarify. snake came in at a very awkward moment. Where <laughs> Pika is cursing at all water. Oh my god, I'm gonna die. Has entered. Okay. Uh, but basically, remember when you said that Pokemon eats uh, black children? Remember that? Well, I said it eats children, and then Momo came at an awkward moment, making it sound like they eat black children. And I came in because you just named your shiny racist bigot! <laughs> <laughs> I mean, am I racist. wrong? It's not racist bigot, what, what was it you named it? Racist sand. Yeah, racist sand. And apparently <laughs> Nintendo allows you to name your Pokemon that. It's just in. Pokemon is entirely fine with racism as long as it doesn't affect their bottom line. It's so, so weird. Yeah. It's so weird because, um, uh, Ash wanted to name one of their Pokemon something that had, like, a curse word in it. And Nintendo literally doesn't allow you to make that, to give your Pokemon that nickname because it has a curse word in it. But I guess they've got exceptions. Yeah, racism. We can tolerate racism here at Nintendo.gov, <laughs> but we will not, yeah, but we I'm draw them. I'm literally inspired by a weird conversation me and Momo had in an oh accident God. Momo made, which made it sound like the Sandy guys ate, ate black children. I know. I, I saw. I'm, um... Oh, yeah. I, I'm always watching, even when you don't think I am. It's just in. We here at Nintendo.gov can make exceptions to allowing racism, but we draw the line at curse word. <laughs> also, considering Momo's reaction to realizing what he had accidentally done, <laughs> I don't think he could argue his way out of that. <laughs> Momo can barely argue his way out of anything. <laughs> That's why we love Momo. I can barely... Yeah, true. Mm hmm? What? Oh, I said, I said yeah, that was true. Mm -hmm. Oh. I didn't say anything else. The, the shiny... Apparently, I thought Bright said the shiny of that was black, but that's brown. That makes it worse. That's not brown, that's black. <laughs> That's I, black. It looks quite black to me. <laughs> yeah, that's black. Sure, are you eventually right? If event was like little, like teal, not teal, what aquamarine? What's all little aquamarine pebbles? Yeah. Right. Eventually, you're gonna say or do something to get you canceled, assuming you haven't already, and I refuse to help you out of that. I feed my lemon shark orphans. I don't think that's I don't think that's bad enough. <laughs> but no, like Jerry, I'm looking at it. It's black. Are, are you okay? <laughs> it is not black. It's black. It's Jerry, black. are you looking at shiny san sandy gas or are you looking at regular sandy gas? I'm looking at shiny sandy gas. That is not black. In stream planning? Uh, I guess sandy it's kind of like a black. dark... It's, it's kind of like in between yeah. brown and black. Yeah. Well, it's, a, it's a dark... Spood just said it looks gray with hints of brown. I, 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 I'm pretty sure it's black because it's supposed to be like... 
you know, like also, a, a black I sand beach. Also, to take color samples. It has purple, blue, and red, and orange. Meaning it's literally gray and brown. Oh well. Don't tell it's Nintendo just... that. It's just then, group of friends argues viciously about the color of a blotch of deadly sand. <laughs> We discuss the race of a sand. <laughs> yeah, uh, 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 before it slips from my memory completely, Adarna, I thought, I I thought, what well, with the uh, Momo thing, I thought you said, I thought instead of true, I thought you said chew, and then I was about to say you can't prove anything. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I'm gonna go probably watch this on Twitch, maybe not, I don't know. I, I'm still getting over smoke inhalation. <laughs> smoke inhalation? Ooh. Wait, what? Yeah. What happened? Are you good? Well, the fires were very active years ago in, in the Bay Area, area of California. I walked quite a lot of miles during going to college, and ever since that point, anytime there's a big fire, I get sick. Wait, uh, Jerry, you went to college? Yes! Yeah. I Dave, he said it multiple times. That's such a <laughs> diss. Remember? <laughs> I'm not like mean. a full psychiatrist, but I've definitely graduated the first, uh, the first step. You need to graduate a few more times before that, but I do not have the money for that, and I do not have the brain for that. I mean, that's actually kind of cool to actually graduate. I don't, I, Jerry, trust me, I'm in college right now. Everyone in this voice call can tell you why I can't even speak a straight line right now. And I, I I guarantee you, I don't have the brain for college either. I went to art college. That's all I have to say no, about that. Just remember, I had the same amount of education I do now when Cephalon tried to argue they knew more about psychology than me. Cephalon? Yeah. Oh. Oh, he, they're a person that's banned on the server. I just died. Oh. What happened? We're talking about someone that oh, apparently no, Hatchet has blocked out of the depths of their brain and soul, which I do not blame. Well, I don't remember if I... Do you remember no, Dimitri? No. no, no. Revive me. Revive me. Do I remember what? Dimitri, a person who spanned a lot of things in every channel. Oh, yeah, that, that, yeah. He, they defended them. And uh, before we can actually get them help, uh, they warned, and now we can no longer help them. Before we could actually get them help, they what? Yeah, we were actually going to try and talk. Demetrius and... Demetrius fled all help because of Cephalon. Yeah. Because Cephalon made them scared of us. Uh. So yeah, that's also... So yeah, that, that happened. They're banned. It's... Oh, wait. Yeah, now... Oh, that's, that's why Seph's no longer in the server? I think you used to know, but you kind of blocked it out of your brain. No, I I was never informed why Seth left. I thought they just uh, left with their own volition. I no. I think we told everyone. Did only mods know? I, it was probably just staff only, yeah. Sorry. Oh, it was just staff and me and, like, uh... It was just staff, me and Keelan, pretty much. This was oh, before yeah. you were staff, too. Yeah, because... We weren't going to put any blame on you, uh, And we knew, Adara. and Sunju knew, they were someone who actually had the issue that oh, yeah. Cephalon and Demetrius were pretending to have. They poked so much holes into their oh. stories. 
Oh. Wait, pretending to have. I wouldn't say they were. I I wouldn't say they were pretending. The, they necessarily. well. They weren't getting help for Thinking you have something without any proof and not even lining up with the symptoms and doing things differently than it actually does. Yeah, they were pretending. Wait, are you talking about DID? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, jeez. Wait, someone with DID actually pointed a lot of holes in why neither of them have DID. Yeah, yeah, shit, that's all and new it's to a me. very serious thing to have. Princess, Those who have it need all the help they can get, and it's not okay to pretend to have it. It makes it harder for people who do have it to get the help. It's not okay. Yeah. Yeah, damn. Like... I'm very confident I was never told any of this. I thought Steph just left it their own voice. You want to hear something funny, though, uh, Hatchet? On another mm -hmm. server I have, they said, Oh, you can't make me leave that server. I instantly banned them from the server. <laughs> Wait, Teflon actually said that? Yeah, pretty much. Oh. Wow. <laughs> Imagine thinking that you're entitled to a space so heavily that you can just outright say, You can't ban me from the server. You can't fire me, I quit. <laughs> it's not even that. They're just like, You can't fire me. I'm standing here. <laughs> <laughs> I'm in the building at this current time. You can't fire me. Wait, I just realized I have never banned Seth from my Twitch channel. Hmm. Well, I don't think they've ever come to your Twitch channel. At least not a few since, times. Like, yeah. yeah, like, at least not since, like, the early Minecraft, not Minecraft, uh, Among Us stuff. Oh, uh, yeah. yeah. To be honest, yeah. I forgot that they even existed. That's <laughs> probably mean, but I am too tired to care. Oh, then That's I guess, ex valid. then I guess excuse me as I go back and double check that I... Uh, deleted their DMs and un unfriended them. Also, I will have to say, uh, since I said, I just realized they probably only said it to staff, there was actually a hint that Cephalon would be trouble early on. I just never said anything because I could kind of chucked it up to me and Cephalon not getting along. Oh yeah, I forgot. You and Seth did not like each other. <laughs> well, yeah, yeah. That similar, si similar situation with me and Shadowfire. I just do not. I do not like him, Sam. I am. With, yeah, we took uh, care of that too. It was kind of depressing because we tried warning them several times, and they just. Did y'all have to? to... Did y'all have to? Well, and the thing he like fire? posted. Yeah, we we well, the we, thing we that got booted him booted. like last month. Yeah. Yeah, he <laughs> kept uh, putting eighteen plus things around children, which we yeah. heard him so many times. No, even though we deleted and moved the things, he he kept doing well, it. Well, I can even also. We did that and told him no. And uh, also, he the put thing that he stuff posted. There. Yeah, I specifically remember that was uh and yes, like e like the, I, the I, thing I, he posted we yeah. that got him kicked out like, like that was like the last straw was he already posted in an eighteen plus channel like months before. And it and it wasn't just that, but like every time we tried to tell him to knock it off and just get get off whatever this um uh fucking tom flurry that, that he was on he would just like he would like fuck like he he would fight back on it every single time and be like i don't see the issue when we just got finished telling him the issue and yeah. I don't know 
Like, at that point, I can't help you. Like, what's the left for me? What's the left for us to say? When we give the answer to you, and you're like, I don't know what the answer to this is. This is slightly off topic, but could you make the joke that Bright is taking her shark out to the Olive Garden? Oh, dear God. <laughs> oh, this is my new boyfriend. I'm sorry. <laughs> Oh my god. Right is L a scaly. Confirmed. Lucky. <laughs> no, that's a joke. Shut the fuck up, Lucky. Oh my god. Um, Wait, does a Dirtle want to date book, Lemon? Bonk Chew. <laughs> no. Chew said. Chew oh. said. Chew said Lucky. Okay, so Chew wants to date Lemon. I'm confirmed. AC Avro. Oh yeah, ear. Oh yeah, I forgot. Wait. Yeah, like I, I guess that's the thing. I, not being a member of staff, had not noticed other times where Shadowfire was doing that. As far as I had seen, the only like infringement that I had seen in my past memory was the incident in dumb posts where they posted that fucking review that contained triggering words yeah, oh, yeah. and th there was other stuff i felt the need to put up like the fact that he was creepy and weird in other servers mm. including uh wouldn't you believe it somewhere else where i happen to mod where the hell that works um Sirs's server? Yes, that is the only other server where I mod. I think. I can't remember. As I said, <laughs> I am very sleepy. <laughs> the, um, these are the two. These are the two servers you... that are most heavily in your mind. Well, okay, Chu. If her. I just realized you have both like an... uh, servers that you mod for have furries. How do you feel? <laughs> Oh, um, she was a furry, so... I don't feel anything except to get numb. That's fair. Uh, but yeah, like... The, the, again, with the posting inappropriate stuff where it's not supposed to be... Um, and where I told them... Like, obviously, I mean... Like, when I say, remove this, that means... Remove it now. Yeah. Uh, yeah, so I had to DM them immediately afterwards to say, hey, can you not? And, like, there was other stuff we had to bring up, like the fucking, uh, infantilizing me. Oh, um, yeah. and, like, treating me unironically like I am, and, like, a small pet animal which okay yes fun is fun yes small mouse chew woo loaf all that good all the good things um but i'm not a baby and i'm not a pet yeah. and if i were a pet first and foremost i wouldn't be a literal pet and s second of all it would not be for you <laughs> yeah. It'd be for Ash. Hush. Um, <laughs> but, uh, yeah, I had to do that. Uh, I, I had to bring that up. And the fucking DMing me out of the blue at, like, in the early hours of the morning to the point where I was like, I am trying to sleep. And then they would DM me anyway. Like, I- I am- Like, I- Granted, Bright does technically do it too, where I'll get random DMs while I'm sleeping, but at least Bright gets the fucking point when I say, Bright, I'm trying to get some rest. Please yeah. let me sleep. Well, I will look Bright at- Bright may be annoying and chaotic, but she's not stupid. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, like, Bright, Well, she's I'm... not stupid in that way. 
I, I, I am. I'm, she's stupid, but she's not stupid. I am trying yeah. to get some sleep because I have shit to do in yeah. the morning. May uh, I will take a look at your questionable news article when I wake <laughs> up in the morning. <laughs> That's a really good way to put most of what Greg sends people. Questionable news article. Oh, if you think what Bright sends is questionable, you should see the stuff Spoon sends me. <laughs> I don't think any of us want to know about that at, at the oh, moment. Oh, come on, they're my sibling! How bad do you think it is? Um... Is more chaotic than Bright? Considering the shit that Bright sends me, that does concern me. What about the Squidward, Squidward thing? I'm Squidward, I'm Squidward, 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 Squidward. I genuinely just did not actually click on that, because when you sent that to me, my brain was just, like, not having any of it. <laughs> I ain't... Let me, let me go look at the title. Uh... When you sent yeah, that to me... I know this way. Yeah, when you sent that to me, I was just absolutely not going to click on a YouTube short by someone named Uncle Al that is titled Squidward Busts a Nut. I Wait. am not clicking on that. Wait, Uncle Al? Yeah. I, th I think that's the person who made like that really funny Spongebob meme that I showed you guys that one time where it was an edit of that scene with Man Ray where he was like, I would like to purchase one Game Boy game. And it was the, uh... Yeah. That's not my wallet. Oh yeah, that. Yeah, I th he he made that. He also made... Oh, yes, this is one of the few things I ever sent food that is weird. God. Define weird. Is it, God. like, me weird? Or just... Or tame, but you don't think it's tame. Can Lemon stop killing bees? I, I think it depends on how you look at it. It's kind of like... Why? Right, you need to be a better shark handler. I think a good way to describe it... You could look at it in dumb posts, but a good way to describe it is... How to cut avocado wrong. Uh, hey, Hatchet. I kind of want to make Garchomp Wait. come in real life and send it to and uh, show it to a person who studies sharks for a living and say, Hey, like, would you like to meet this shark? <laughs> Honestly, like any shark scientist that I know of would be so fucking ecstatic to be studying a fucking land shark. Like that shit's cool as hell. But also, what the fuck is going on in this image? So we've got a guy that... Obviously, improperly cutting an avocado. But why is... Oh, is it a... Okay. Yeah, and in the video, she was asking, why is the avocado so hard to cut through? What is this thing in the center? Oh my god, this is... Do you take it out? This is... <laughs> god. Oh my god, this is the whitest thing I've ever seen. <laughs> oh my They're god. Black. Pika? I ain't even what? white! <laughs> oh no, that's a white! They're black! It's a black woman! How is that? Oh my god. Why? She's black. Is that what's happening? It's She's just in. She's a black in. woman who doesn't know what an avocado pit is. It's just in. Black woman attempts to cut an avocado without taking out the pit and then wonders why it's so hard to chop. You might want to rethink that headline hatchet. Just like a tiny bit. To an extent. But what? I don't know. Why are you still listening to me? You know I'm sleepy. We need a, a chew. Uh, to have a podcast where they just are sleepy all the time and say random shit. Anyway, I will once again be reading uh, my sponsor read. Unlearn language. Have you become too eloquent? Do you? Do your thoughts and feelings effortlessly exit your body in delightful prose? I am Bigman Bum. I am Bigman Beefus, 
and I want to help you disappear inside a self-made prison of violence and fear. Learn these techniques. Tortured moaning, panicked whimpering, pitiful wailing, were... and many were... more. I thought you were going to say something very, very different. Right, At the then, end, no. it was almost perfect, and then you, you <laughs> missed. It's perfect. <laughs> Learn these techniques. No. Learn these techniques, Dommy oh. Mommy. <laughs> what the fuck? Learn these techniques, Dommy Mommy. Get stepped on. But yeah, uh... Hey, Jerry, you want me to make you a sandwich? No. <laughs> Just the immediate no. <laughs> well, that's I not... I if I can cook better than you. Well, God you. damn. The first shots have been fired. <laughs> We already, we all know that Jerry grew up in a farming community. Like, that just, like... Hey, sticks. just because I grew up seeing cows and sheep and chicken doesn't mean I'm automatically better at cooking. Yes, it is. Well, yeah, but it would increase no. the likelihood that you're good at cooking. God the math you. check, the math check, so... I wish yeah. I wasn't good at cooking so I could prove you wrong, but I am! <laughs> <laughs> See? The math never lies. Debunk debunking the snake with facts and logic. The, the rare occasion where a mouse beats a snake. Man, Lemon's a hungry boy. They have eaten 479 olives so far. It's just in. Shark consumes a large amount of olives and promptly die. <laughs> Honestly, if they really ate that many olives, about did how much oil they have in their system, they'd be pooping all night. <laughs> well, I mean, they do have a really oily liver. Oh. Yeah, like sharks don't have a swim bladder, and to compensate for that, they have a liver that's like. Uh, spans the majority of their body that's just covered in oil. It's actually really gross in dissections. Apparently, like, it stinks bad. I feel apparently, like, yeah. they would not be bothered by olive oil. That actually makes sense. I, well, I feel stinks, like dissecting but... anything would smell bad, considering oh, yeah, you're cutting it's... something open. Well, yeah, but it's particularly bad. Like, we're talking about people who work with and commonly dissect sharks, like or like and fish in general and like specifically the liver makes cutting into a shark very un unpleasant i can agree with hatchet i had to dissect cookie cutter shark it was yeah it was something to smell i, I dissected yeah. it oh would you like to hear a very funny twist of fate and in sophomore year, do you know what I had to dissect in, um, sen in senior year of high school? A mouse? No, silly. I had to dissect a squid. Oh. Okay. Oh, yeah. You want to know? Right. Oh, God. You want me to send you the last ten weird picture, weird things food sent me? Sure. Yeah. I'm probably oh. not going to look at it immediately, but sure. But, um, would you like to also know what I dissected? Or what they said is dissection, but I'm pretty sure it's called something different. Uh. Sure. They had me go through owl poop and take out the bones. Go through what? Owl poop. Why did they have you go through owl poop? That's to take out the bones. Common. Oh, really? What in the Jurassic yeah, Park? Yeah, owl poop is kind of a way to have kids look at the bones of an animal without killing an animal. Okay, yeah, that does make sense. I feel like they could have done the shit digging for you. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to your new yeah. ecology. Welcome to your new ecology classes. Kids, the first step is dig through this pile of bird shit. Wait, I don't think Chu was here when I told this about my science teacher. Uh, for chemistry. 
Oh dear god, no. Alright, Chu, so basically we we're learning about compounds and how mixing chemicals can make things. I and... hated chemistry so much. Please don't remind me of chemistry. And they had us... And he showed us exactly what chemical compound makes crystal sugar. <laughs> um... <laughs> okay. And I'm not talking about sugar, I'm talking about the drug. Breaking back. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Base... Yeah. Base teacher. <laughs> what? Jesse? Okay. Jesse? Yeah. We Jesse. have to teach these students how to cook, Jesse. <laughs> Jesse! <laughs> I got a part-time job at the school, Jesse! <laughs> Keep in mind, I've never watched Breaking Bad, and no one will ever be able to make me. Oh, me no. I don't... No one... No one has that level of power over me. I saw the first episode of it and I was like, I'm, I'm, I'm bored. I mean, I am bored. <laughs> I am too powerful to be controlled. Yeah, Do we need to get how, Ash or Momo in the call? <laughs> <That's sorry. laughs> what makes you think that Momo has control over me? <laughs> no, it's just because you two get <laughs> like argue with each other <laughs> for a while. I'm not going to comment on that <laughs> because you know just, I'm right. Just as a precaution, and just <laughs> I just claim that you can't prove anything. I'm not going to give you evidence. This is not a court of law, and you do not have the right to plead the fifth here. Well. Good luck getting info uh, proof out of me. Or anything that's self implicating. Because you're not gonna. We've had plenty of self implicating shit, too. No, you haven't. Not enough to even Chew, know. What I'm... Do I need to. Chew, do I need to bring up. <clears throat> the, um. Entire. Do, do I need to bring up, uh, what is it called? Sorry. Do I need oh to God. bring up no voice? Do I need to bring it, bring up crow votes 18 and up? Wait, what's going uh, on? Um, right I'm do, not I, do I need to bring up 18 plus? I'm not concerned because you don't even know what I'm what I'm implying here, so I am not worried. You would be looking at information, but it's not relevant information. So I win. Mm, I don't think that's how that works. I think I've sent bright over 10 things that food has sent me over time, so I'm gonna stop there and do my laundry very fast. No. Okay. What? What do you mean, no? <laughs> right. I was joking. Yeah, I, I say that when everyone says they're gonna do something. I just say no. <laughs> it's just I... done. One Dr. Bright is an absolute cock face. <laughs> oh my god. Alright, time to kill this this really thick fish. In what way? I'm sorry, I'm sorry. By shooting it with its own No, I was talking about the, eggs. the thickness. I was talking about the thickness. Right, what's wrong with you? <laughs> Not even me in my most sleepy state would do this. It, okay, question. Is that fish a boff? A what? A boff. Big old what is fat fecund female. I, it, is I a don't term have... within, it is a term within fishing to refer to a an older female fish that has the high capacity to reproduce. Hmm, no, because this is not a female fish. Okay, that's fair. Wait, so then, is it a filth? Oh, for... <laughs> no, no, that's just saying that makes me feel gross. Now I have to add that to the deck oh. at some point. Oh god. 
everyone here knows what I mean when I say it's filth, right? Please don't make me explain Father, it. I like the fuck? Mm. No. Huh? No, we're talking about fish, you dumb fuck. <laughs> God, I hate you sometimes. <laughs> so, is there a reason why only I ever get bonked? I get bonked well, fairly because frequently. Because you just shared that with me, I'm going to send that to Bray. Yeah, like, what are you talking about, Sheila? I get bonked very frequently. Not enough. In fact, oh. In fact, lately, I get bonked more frequently than you because I'm more active in the streams. Also, a hatchet? Bookworm says, what's a filth? Oh, god damn it, Bookworm. No. What, what? I think what a filth is a male version of a mill. No. No, when no, I said that... filth. When I said yeah, filth. there's already an alternative to that jury. It's called, they're called DILFs. Yeah, Dad, I don't. Oh. Yeah. The, the, the acronym that I created is filth. I.E. Since we are talking about fish, it's a... <laughs> Oh! No! No! I hate myself. Why? Why did you do it? I don't know. My brain has no filter. What the hell is a filter? What language are you people speaking? I have had Lemon eat 550 olives. Congratulations. I really am right. starting to suspect that Lemon is in fact a bonnethead shark. Right, I think we need to have a serious discussion about this weird force feeding thing you have going on with your land shark. Why, you want to be a part of it? No. <laughs> what? Oh. No, Chu oh. wants to be in the shark. <laughs> oh my god! Specifically in the belly. With the olives. Chu is becoming jealous of the olives. <laughs> oh my god. Chu's gonna. No, Chew. do not corrupt. Do not corrupt Jiri for. Oh, uh, Jiri Chu. Jiri Chu loves Vor. I, I hate yeah. all that. Yeah, yeah. Drew, says, uh, Drew says, I already know that. Yeah, like, Jiri's been around for a lot of our jokes. They have to have figured that out by now. God, I'm a terrible shot. I'm a terrible shot. My real-life archery isn't paying off right now. Haha. <laughs> Just make sure you don't do it in windy weather, Jew. Of course not. I have survival instincts. Unlike people who fucking go skiing. I'm not gonna mention why I brought that up. Jiri knows what Do they I have mean. survival instincts? Because I don't know people who do that would willingly go on a mountain at all. Hey, yeah. Chu, would you like to go on a mountain with me? Um... <laughs> We all know what she's like. <laughs> I will go on the mountain if I stay home and I can watch you from the safety and comfort of my own living room. Sure. So that if, any sure. so that if anything happens, do. I can just be like, damn. Well, time for me to make lunch. <laughs> Wait, so make back lunch. Wait, so back up. Is the new canon that she was also scared of mountains in general? <laughs> no, yes. the new canon is that me in real life don't put myself in situations that I know are dangerous for no good reason. You're saying... There is no inherent danger in going to a mountain. Are you sure? At the very least, there's no more inherent. You are quite literally more likely to die in a city center than at a mountain. Exactly. Why do you think I don't go there? So you're saying you don't. So you're saying. No, I hate traveling. Sure. Sure, you travel. 
That's why I refuse to get on a plane. I refuse to get on a boat. The best you're gonna get out out the best you're gonna get out of me is a train. It's trains are cool. Play, than it is to walk down the street. Yeah, you're like exactly. Why do you, Jerry? Trust me, I'm aware of how dangerous it is to walk down the street. Okay, but um. And I'm gonna point out. I know. It's even I'm, more safe for you to be on a plane than it is to walk down the street. Are you sure? Because yes. um, airlines don't exactly calm when they see someone with a complexion that's dark that's darker than uh milk are, are you saying they're going to assume you're a terrorist that Wait. is exactly what i'm saying Look, lemon's having difficulties getting to that <laughs> they gotta get over the fence like while oh. racism does exist especially like in tsa systems the act of riding a plane is not particularly dangerous you are likely oh, going to experience. Likely to get mistaken for a terrorist. I know I've been on a plane so many times, and considering my mixed family, I've never seen anyone in my family be searched, besides my one stepdad, who is a disabled veteran and also happens to have a dark complexion. Never mind. <laughs> The point being that, like, the Just flight itself I said isn't. Just I said like, there's definitely racism in how, like, you know what? people are searched. Searched him not because they were racist, but because they were ableist, so that's worse. You know what? Just ignore everything I'm saying. There's nothing weird about people only searching the guy in the wheelchair. Oh, that's bad. I'm I'm shutting up. I'm like, Jerry, to, for your credit, everybody here already knows what I've been through today, so yeah. I, I, no mean this, I mean today. this, I mean this in the kindest way when I say I am only barely paying attention, because yeah. that is the best I can manage. Well, I, I, I will spare, today, I, I will, Jerry, do you want me to say so you don't have to say it again? Please, I don't like saying words. <laughs> uh, Chu had to do like 12 different projects. Seven. Oh, Seven. oh I... That's See, this is why it's us. bad to let me do it. But yeah, so... So, where did I get the number 12 from? Now that hurts my brain. Anyway, point being, Chu had to complete a whole, like, a whole last seven projects. Like, over the course of today. And that. last night I had to, I tried to do an all-nighter, but my body just said no. So I went to bed at 3, woke up at 7.30, got right back to work. Only just finished. Also, I feel bad for you, Pika, but can also, can I also just... Can we just pretend like the airlines have no issues with people in wheelchairs? Just one more time. No, no, because ignoring it would ignore would be t to ignore some very serious problems that need fixing. Okay, well. We are not going to pull a heckin' white liberal up in here. Also, airlines. Or I should say white have moderate. Issues with short buff women, because out of the many, 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 many. My mom has been on an airplane in an airport. The stewardesses of all genders always get in her way when she is lifting, when she was lifting my stepdad. Like, get out of my way. They stand deliberately in front of her. Which is not getting out of her way. Do you think they're making it easier by literally standing in front of her and asking if she needs help i guess that's i i guess in that case that kind of sounds like it's it may be less of a systemic issue and more just like individuals not piecing together that they're being a pain no, no, they do it every time and also if you think lifting a heavy pot is hard 
then why would anyone with any amount of brain think lifting a person wouldn't be hard? That they shouldn't just get out of the way! All of you to assume that there's a brain rattling around in there. Pika. You already know I'm not nice. That's you know fair. what You're I am. too tired to pretend right now. See? Everyone's barely... tired. Which means yeah. anything goes. She barely pretends anyway. Yeah, also, fair. there's two messages I want to read from Bookworm. This just in, Lemon doesn't know what a fence is. <laughs> hey, dipshit teammates, rescue me. It's and just in, Land Shark does not know how to compute a land-based fence. <laughs> yeah. Oh, you're kidding me. And the well, next to one... to be fair, you can fence in Shark. And the other one is, will this shiny olive be the olive from hell? Only time will tell. Will you find? I don't think you'll find a shiny olive. Are you just looking for one? That's what Bright's doing right now, trying to find oh. a shiny olive. That's why Bright's having women commit mass homicide on the olives. I will have to say, this may sound mean, but I do not blame you. I love black olives, they taste <laughs> amazing. These are I... not black olives, these are the green ones. I hate all oh. olives equally. Are the shiny ones black? Yeah. Oh, oh yeah, the shiny yeah, ones that's would what be I was black. saying, yeah. See? Oh, okay, I thought you were speaking, like, towards Bright killing all of these olives right now. No. I can't, and I... green olives are okay, but I love black ones more, and... I've had green ones that are okay, I've had green ones that I've liked, I've had red ones that I've liked. Why are there red olives? I can't yeah. stand olives. I, if I could wipe out all the olives, I would wipe out all the olives. Oh, Wait. Yeah. bruh, Wait, bruh. What? Wait, Moonflower just responded in stream playing. You spell volcanic wrong. What? Yeah, that tracks. Oh, I get it. <laughs> it took me a second. <laughs> <laughs> Oh god, I'm gonna die. Hey, can someone help me? I'm getting swarmed. Ryan doesn't understand, sorry, so I will send it to them. I'm sorry, your teammates kind of suck, Pika. You know what? You know what? No. I'm gonna sacrifice them. Screw them. What? I'm more important. Always have been. Ew. Why does that not surprise me you'd say that? I mean, it never should have surprised you. It didn't surprise me. And I'm not sure how I feel about that. The best advice I can give is don't. Because that right. only... Exactly. Now you're getting it. I like how Lemon's just walking around me in circles while I was typing something. That was cute. Yeah, I agree. Because <laughs> he falls. Oh, because I've almost killed 666 olives. Yeah. <laughs> Not walking, running. Oh yeah, fair, running. Pika Very adorable. so scared of life that they are... They avoid walking outside. Or do they? Yeah, yeah, I don't like going outside, because it sucks. But what if the inside is technically outside? What? Bright, <laughs> please don't take advantage of my already sleep-deprived brain. That's very not fair. I think the simple way to put it is Bright is stupid. Wait, I'm starting to kind of get why Chu's into war then. Did you just want to be you... inside people? <laughs> yeah, exactly. Like, when you think about it, like, getting bored means that you're in a nice, warm, comfy place, safe from the outside. But you're also gonna get digested! It was not into the digestion part, but it's also broadly a type of fantasy, so... Oh my god, I'm gonna die. Someone sacrificed themselves for me. 
It ain't cannibalism if Chu's getting eaten by their dragon lover. Okay. I was talking about that digestion part, that part. Oh, speaking of which, the the IRL friend who made the uh our yeah, our character's um biological child, yes, my Chu and his male dragon boyfriend have a biological child. Don't think about it too much. You hate um, uh, Beast. They recently, um, uh, finally finished coloring in the drawing that they made of her, and she looks very, very adorable, and she looks so much like, um, well, mostly one of her parents, but a very funny detail is that since one of her dads is a dragon at the end of the day and since there's already like a natural size difference between the two um Chu's daughter is significantly bigger than he is and as a <laughs> result whenever she gets like into a tantrum he will literally just hunt him across the room into a wall <laughs> I, I want an animation of that. I mean, let's be frank. Like, as, as like you're a Saiyan, you're practically invincible. You might as well. Uh, not, it probably hurts like a tiny bit more than it would. Like, it grants it. Yes, he, he's not gonna die or anything. But you need to keep in mind. He and she inherited both of her father's um strength. Oh yeah, true. So you've got a Saiyan dragon kicking you across the room. A Saiyan dragon Pikachu kicking me around. Oh yeah, P yeah. Plus Pikachu, Jesus Christ. Also, um, I would like to. I am very sorry to Chu for having to make him uh, go through the pregnancy. It was not pleasant. I am so very sorry. Oh wait, Chu was the You're one with the baby. You're apologizing to your character? Yes. Oh no! How did that work? I'm not, I'm not um, apologizing to my character about being pregnant by I haven't heard you To be perfectly honest, children. My friend and I already decided that you would be the one to, like, have, to, to like, lay the egg. But we couldn't, uh, we couldn't find an obvious answer to, one, the size difference, again, and two, the, the, they're both male, so we had no idea how to come how to make this work so we decided to go with the tried and true explainer of every plot contrivance magic that was the best we could do we just said magic at least you didn't do that one thing that one uh yoy manga did where they say they put a parasite up the ass that makes you pregnant Jerry, what the fuck are you watching? <laughs> and where can you get these parasites? That is a manga, and I'm positive those are imaginary parasites. He didn't say where I can get them. <laughs> right? Why are you interested in the weird... Anime with not anime, the weird manga with animal people and like, also the one thing that I do still think is wholesome about Do and his um special dragon friend um is the fact that like he naturally got significantly more protective of Chu due to just 
instincts. And I thought that was very cute, even if it manifested it itself in ways that made you very, very annoyed. He gets annoyed a lot. Gee, I wonder where he got that trait from. No clue. Yeah, I do. Yeah. <laughs> I can't think of a. I I can't think of anyone in this combo that like gets annoyed very easily. Catch it. I mean, I guess I do get annoyed very easily. Damn it. Yeah, especially with the shit I do. <laughs> 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 Wait, how did your child inherit my personality? <laughs> Why? Are, how did you two have children? That just raises even more questions. No, that's the point, too. Your child inherited my personality trait. That's the joke. <laughs> Magic. But also, I was gonna say, like, with Bright, like, uh, demanding to, um, find out how to get the butt baby parasite. Uh, I was gonna say, it's like Chew's, or it's like Bright's doing the exact opposite of that one meme Chew posted, where it's like, breed me, no pregnant, but breed me. It's like Bright's going, no breed me, but pregnant, don't <laughs> breed me. <laughs> Not what the meme said. It was like that, um, Okay, someone needs to- Okay, no, no. I'm not dealing with this. Someone needs to go kill that big shot over on the beach right now. <laughs> Otherwise, we're not gonna win this round. Also, Hatchet's here- You're thinking about the- Um... About the- Uh... Thing giving on to the child. I forgot what you said, but uh... Uh, Pokemon said it was a three-way. I had no Is part in this. <laughs> No. <laughs> I also fake news. Speaking of which, I also feel like I should apologize to Chu for all the stuff that I made him go through with <laughs> with his boyfriend. I God, I if if this if he were real and he knew me, he would hate me. But in all fairness, like, both of our characters, along with another mutual friend of ours characters, we tried to tell Chu, who you, you probably shouldn't provoke a uh, guy while it's his um mating season. That's probably not a good idea. But Chu doesn't like to listen very well. So, I am so very sorry. Is my sleepiness starting to show yet? Hey, Chu, how do you feel about me having a, ch a child with a, wa with a watermelon? Um... What? More power to you. <laughs> we need more... We need more watermelon representation. <laughs> give me watermelons or give me death. I feel like someone's more, gonna get mad at me for more saying that. More female watermelon drone pilots. I feel like someone's gonna get mad at me for asking about the watermelon ch uh, child to chew. Why? I'm gonna get mad about you. That's literally one of the most basal bullshit jokes you've <laughs> ever made. I don't know. I was just thinking. Uh, I was thinking about racist jokes for a moment as soon as I said that. Oh. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Oh, fuck. Oh, no. Well, t uh, listen, Bright, I'm hereby giving you the pass, so you're good to go. Yeah, like, that's, that's again, the common thing. You seem to say things without properly thinking through their implications until it's too late. Yeah. Guys, Jerry, I mean, Bright didn't mean it, so I am, so I, this is, this is her official, um, one time pass to please let this go and don't <laughs> hold it against her. See, oh, no, now you're good. No, 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 you see, that's the thing, we will hold it against her. We just all also know that she's not intending to be racist. <laughs> The pass, not the pass. <laughs> right. yeah, in, 
<laughs> in in the same in the same way that we will never let Bright live down uh the Romani poem. The black the the black neighborhood in GTA. <laughs> or off switch. Yeah, or off switch. Fortunately there or is that, nothing. Or, or that one game of uh Cards Against Humanity. At this point, I can just say that one game of Cards Against Humanity, and everyone who is there knows. Yeah. Um, if I do know, I'm too tired to remember. Speaking of which, I should probably go to sleep, but I refuse. Go to I fuck the bed. Go to bed. No, none of you yes. are in charge of me, and none of you are my parents. Hey, Chu. I'll act temporarily like a parent. Go to bed right now. No. You yeah. really do need to sleep, Chu. I don't want to. Think about it, Chu. A I will throw Chew. a tantrum in this voice call. Chew. It is you not beneath what? me. Maybe you need your belly rubbed, because I do know sometimes people need their belly rubbed to help them feel better before they go to bed. What the fuck did that come from? <laughs> sometimes I need my belly rubbed. <laughs> Where did that come from? No, listen, noted. Chew. Listen, Chu, Chu. What would Ash want from you right now? What you would can't, Ash you want you to do? Ash. Now see, that's cheating, because you're not supposed to use that against me. Yeah, that just did, it, this isn't using this against you. We're doing something for your own good by pointing out that someone you care about would want your own self-interest involved. What yeah. if I message Momo right now that she doesn't want to sleep? Momo does... I'm not gonna answer. I'm not gonna answer. <laughs> I'm not gonna respond. I'm not gonna finish that what thought. What did Momo do? Nothing. They would probably get an argument. That. What? Not gonna answer. I'm not giving anyone here the satisfaction of hearing the answer to that. I have no response, I'm and I will not be taken. About this entire thing. Perfect. That's what I want. I hear bright typing. <laughs> Uh oh. Pika, do you want to talk oh, no. to Momo? I didn't say that. I don't know where you're getting these ideas. I'm not gonna give you the satisfaction of giving you the answer to she, these questions. She has a small list of people who who hold a certain level of and intimate sent? tension over the, over Chu. Momo is one of the people, yes. That wasn't the... Fine, I will tell you that's not the correct answer. Oh, okay. But I will not... In fact, some of you prior have guessed the correct answer. But the best part of my special brand of bullshittery, I will never tell you who got the correct answer, or what the correct answer was. Then I'm just going to assume you don't want to be your daddy. As soon as I put the bread on, it, it, it the, the sandwich gets fucked up. <laughs> yeah, Chu, you do realize that by not giving us information, you just give us every reason to assume the kinkiest outcome. <gasps> Momo responded. Your silence is deafening. Wait, Momo responded. Momo responded? I'll be there in just a few. That's all I said. <laughs> <laughs> that doesn't go. mean you're going to get the, the true answer. Better get the... Better go well, the fuck to sleep, Chu. Well, going to be a better parent than all of us. We'll get you fun. Go the fuck to sleep. Oh, that sounded weird. Uh, okay, okay, no, yeah. yeah. get people to bed. Oh, that sounds... Uh... <laughs> we weren't... <laughs> We weren't winning we that match. There we go. We weren't get. We weren't winning that match. I was literally getting swarmed. Um, there was a sniper on the other side of the map that has perfect accuracy. There were barriers all around us, and there were enemies spawning from the barriers. We weren't winning. Salmon run is bullshit. Is what I'm trying to say. Hey, hey everyone, everyone. Why did why did the twink get into playing why did the twink get into playing uh Splatoon 3? I'm not a twink. a twink. No, no I'm not calling you a twink. 
I'm I'm just trying to tell a joke. Bad. What? Oh. Why? Why? Why did the twink get into playing Splatoon three? Because he heard about all the barriers. Boo. <laughs> Don't worry, I hate myself too. <laughs> I hate myself every day. I hate myself so much that it loops around to me loving myself. Get on my level. I have hated myself since I, before I even got to this planet. I love myself and I love all of you. Fuck your logic. <laughs> 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 that needs to be quoted. That was great. <laughs> I probably love all of you, Forfly! You do not have to care about me back! What if we no. want to? I don't care if my no didn't make sense. That is my response. Well, my response again, is just no. I don't care if you no. don't like me back. I will love you, Forfly. It's... I will not touch you if you don't want me to touch you. I will not hug you. I will not give you cupcakes. Jerry. 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 I will not give you water. Phrasing. Phrasing. What? Phrasing. Cupcakes? Phrasing. They were adding in clarifiers to, to help dial back the initial statement's phrasing. Oh my god, well, I'm gonna die. Well, Jerry, I will love you by four. <laughs> and also, I won't touch well, yeah, you if you don't want me to stuff. touch you. Hello. Oh, yeah, Momo. Hey, Momo. Hey, Momo. Hey, y'all, what's going on? Uh, I'm shiny, Chew honey. Pico. I'm trying to not Pico. die by Pico. mutated fish. I Pico. feel like there's... I probably said something that I do not understand was more sexual than I thought it was. <laughs> Only thinking that because of others' reactions, and I don't really want to know. <laughs> anyway, what well, is you were saying? I have no... I, Jiri, I, I, I don't actually know. I, I will okay. take your word for it. I don't know it. either. We could be clueless together. Okay, yeah, no, no, right no, on. No, no. There's only one yeah. thing I do know about. Yeah, no, Momo, uh, Pico, this, this Pico, happened you, before you came in here. Pika, do you have something to do in the morning? Do I have something to do with what? The morning. You have something to do in the morning? Do you have somewhere to be? Do you have school or something? Oh, the, oh, you said, do I have something oh. to do in the morning? I thought you said, why would, I was like, why would I, I was about to say, why would I be mourning? Who died? <laughs> No, 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 um, no, 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 nobody, no, so far as I know, nobody close to anybody here has died, so far as I know. I've died Actually, multiple times. Uh, I found out this week that my... Not, well, okay, nobody has died for very long. Yeah. This week, I found out this week. Oh, oh, I, I don't think Momo heard you, Jiri. I think they I wasn't. Yeah, you. I didn't hear you. Yeah. I found out one of my uncles on my dad's side died on the first. Oh, recently. damn. Like this week, I found out he is the one mm. who beat the shit out of the horrible <laughs> uncle. That is my mom's brother that I do not consider an uncle because, well, I'm sure you remember the story. E anyway. Uh, Momo, Momo, what was that you're, you're about to say to Chew? I was just, I was just telling Chew, uh, like, so, 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 Chew, you do, you do have something to, to do tomorrow, or well, this morning. If you mean right back in my basement, then yes, the basement that I'm in right now. Oh, okay. I thought you were in for something else, but now I feel a lot better, and I'm not concerned. You don't have nice try, tomorrow? guys. You failed. I win. You don't have school. As per usual. Yeah. Stop acting like a child and go to bed! You know you're asking... You, you are asking a pig to not eat flop. That's not going to happen. Wait, Shu, when did you become a pig? <laughs> A big stubborn mouse! That is acting like a big stubborn child! 
No. Yes! No. Welcome to the stream, Momo. That's okay, I mean, if you have something to do and you don't accomplish it, that's kind of on you, so... Yeah. No. And you cannot blame anybody else in this book, in this call, if you, if you do not accomplish it. Yeah. Like, hell I can't. It'll be alright. This... Mama, nice this time. is America. I will blame. I will blame people that don't even exist for my problems. <laughs> Fuck you, Abraham Lincoln. Oh sorry, I'm sorry you feel that way. <laughs> I'm sorry you feel that way. Um. Bad Pika. Yeah, go for it. Yeah, but yeah, no, go for it. If you, if you think that'll make you feel better, go for it. Bad that Pika. Can't stop you. You guys oh. did not accomplish the goal I thought you were trying to accomplish by summoning Momo. <laughs> yeah, so, Momo, I think that's Chu was all that scared. Matters. Yeah, Momo, I think Chu was scared that we brought you here to get to the bottom of why you are one of the people that has some level of sway over Chu. <laughs> no. I am. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, no. No, not Joy Contra. No, no. Yep. You, Why Joy-Con drift? Um, so, so, yeah, Momo, Chat. so yeah, you, um, Dix, Raz, and Ash have some pull over two. And I think I know maybe why, I think I know why Ash does. Too. Oh, yeah. I know mm -hmm. why Ash does. That's, mm -hmm. that's, that's as, that's about as obvious, you may as well as, like, you know. I'm gonna go so I can actually get my laundry done and yeah, okay. be constantly distracted by watching. That one's that one's I very very clear. Shark eat olives. Well, shark one shark eat <laughs> olives. Yeah. And yeah, a dog. That, that, that's very clear. I under <laughs> I understand perfectly why Ashwood. <laughs> um, Dix, I'm not sure about Raz. I am sure about Raz is, you know. Has 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 bitchified Pico several times. Um, <laughs> that's 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 that, that, I I know about that. But um, oh, with regards God. to myself, um, actually, Dix Dix kind of makes sense now that I think about it. Um, <laughs> just because. I'm pretty, I like, I'm, I'm pretty sure, I'm pretty sure, um, I can't be 100% certain, but I'm pretty sure, um, that, 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 that Pika might like them, like, in some sort of, like, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh, come on, come on, oh. hold the line. Yeah, I'm pretty <laughs> sure Pika might have a crush on them. So, Hold I guess that line. comes to me. That, I guess that comes down to me and... now. Mm -hmm. I don't know why. I've never bitchified. Oh god. I don't think I have. Nope. Oh god, we're gonna yes. die. Yep, we're done. Well, I guess I'm trying... You see, that's the thing. With Ash in the list, and a couple other people that I figured she had a crush on, at this point, I was... Maybe under the presumptuous wait, assumption. Wait, 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 wait a minute, wait a minute, hang on, wait, hold on. Oh, sorry, sorry, Hatchet, my bad. Sorry, I just, I just, hang on, wait, 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 whoa, 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 wait, wait. So, so, wait, let me, let me figure this out. Let me, so. Why is this suddenly a Resident Evil puzzle? No, 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 I just, no, hang on, wait, no, you, <laughs> quiet, you, quiet, mouse, all right? We're trying to figure out, we're trying to figure you out, shut the fuck up. <laughs> yes, quiet. Now, I'm just, I'm just, maybe I'm, maybe I'm a little fuzzy on the details, but I, what, wrong, am I, wait, so, mm -hmm. so you said... You said that, that they're all mm -hmm. people that mm -hmm. Pika has, and you included mm -hmm. you included my name. Mm -hmm. Wait yeah. a minute! <laughs> Wait a fucking minute! Now, now Wait a fucking minute! Wait a minute! Wait a minute! 
Let me clarify Let me cook. Let me clarify this. Let me cook. Let me let me clarify this. Let me talk. Let let me let me clarify this. I am oh, go, mentioning go that there is a notable number of people on that list that she was presumably oh. attracted to in some oh. manner. So I'm trying okay. to figure out whether or not the entire list is based upon attraction or some other thing. Yeah, okay. Okay, right on. No, yeah. I do no, I was... no ba based on based on Chu's reaction when we asked him true, to, like true, true. about like you and st like um, I, I'm thinking that might be a yes for you. Yeah, I've come <laughs> to think of it, like the way that you react. Yeah, the way that you reacts to the way, like to when we uh, bring up you, is very much the same way that they tend to react to when we bring up Ash. Really? No. Wait. No. So. Oh God. Uh, oh God. Oh God. The, the, Someone help me. Uh, I. Uh, well, Chu, I can't. I'm not playing right now. But. <laughs> I don't have a switch. I don't have a switch. I'm sorry. <laughs> I do, but I don't care. <laughs> I need to. I need to get one. But so wait. Drive so... me. Okay, so hang on one second. <laughs> right. So just, just, just let me, let me, let me piece this together. He's still cooking. <laughs> I'm still. I'm, let me cook. I'm still cooking. <laughs> I'm still cooking. Oh my god, just barely. We won just barely. Alright, round two. Oh god. That's so str- hey, it's so wait, stressful. So when, how- wait, so... How long... Chu, how long have you had- how long has it been like this where, like, I- he, he, like, y'all would bring me up? I don't know, y'all were bringing me up in discussions like that. Um, but how while. long? I don't A remember. While? I'm yeah, Momo. I... I'm running on three hours of sleep right now. I I don't rest, know dude. what anything is anymore. Yeah, hence you why we were rest, trying buddy. to. Get, hence why we were trying to get you to go to sleep. Yeah, it's yeah. You're gonna crash. <laughs> you're gonna crash, dude. It's not gonna be good. Why do you think I don't do you're stay up? Hurt. Why do you think I don't stay up for twenty four hours to do streams? <laughs> Well, because you, I, I, medically, I don't think you'd be able to. Well, yeah. I think you probably could, but. I, oh, yeah, I could. With energy is... drinks. Yes. <laughs> you probably could, but you, you can. You have the ability to sleep when you want to, so. I can sleep on the spikes. Is... <laughs> you really could. Like, you could just kind of. <laughs> there was one. Does. <sighs> I'm sorry to deviate from the the, the Pikachu having a yeah I ruined it <laughs> maybe maybe having a a, 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 a a crush on me the thing but uh, oh, right you no nope. Pika I don't have a switch I'm sorry <laughs> oh but yeah no I um revive me revive me I can't um <laughs> right uh yeah. Do you ever, there was, if you ever watched a show called yeah. A Thousand Ways to Die? Yes. Oh no. Do you know the episode with the guy, that's that's how I first learned about narcolepsy, actually. Oh yeah, I know what you're talking It was from an about. episode where a guy who had narcolepsy fell asleep inside of an industrial oven. Yeah. And he, he cooked alive. Was he tasty? Yeah, no. Sorry. Wow! That was my first wow. time. That's that's. I forget sometimes that like you people are like, some of you motherfuckers are just despicable. I am wow. perfectly normal and no danger to anybody. That is so untrue. You are a tiny electrical mouse. I don't think that is anything. Normal about that. I'm anyway, sorry, Mom. Um, back to the chew. No, you're thing. okay. Was, you're... Uh, yes, yeah. back to no, the chew thing. Anyway, sorry. Back to the chew thing. The, like that's the thing. I'm also not good with spans of time, but I genuinely can't think of 
a time in which Chu didn't have that sort of reaction to us bringing up Momo. Oh. Maybe more stuff. Well. More free stuff. More. Oh, wait, it's not free. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wait, it's more free stuff. More free stuff. Oh, wait, it's not free. <laughs> Chu discovering that they exist under capitalism. <laughs> I don't know. Should I put on my, like,. Should I, should I, I don't know what to do. Should I put on, like, a condom? My super sultry voice? A what? <laughs> what is wrong? Right. Right. I was talking about putting on a super sultry voice. I wasn't talking about putting on anything like that. I, I didn't. I. Nobody's even close enough. To, and I'm at work. That's not. No. I should put Bright on timeout. Bright should what be on timeout. Right? Yeah, you muted Bright. Perfect. Brilliant. <laughs> Outstanding. Hey. Bright deserved that. Hey, Momo. But... I'm sorry. Yes? You, you should put on your Brat Tamer voice. Oh, well, I... It's 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 not as good as I, I think it might be otherwise, but I can, I can try. What is wrong with you people? Oh, no. Hang on, you let, me, let, let it... me grab a drink real quick. Chew, you see... Friends you could have us. just chew. You see, that's the thing. You could have just given us the details, and we might not have come to this. I'm not gonna. <laughs> you can't make me. I literally. I you caused your you. own downfall. I already told you. Someone, at some point, has already said the correct answer. I'm just not going to tell you what the correct answer is. Are you Scott Cawthon? Yes, answer. yes, chew, chew, chew. But you see, you saying this is all we need to know to investigate further and to push you on it. If you had just given mm -hmm. proper information, we wouldn't have reason to be going fucking detective on this bullshit. Wow. Also, <laughs> unironically uh, I, I like doing to say peer one pressure. Thing. Uh, yeah. Chew is Scott Cawthon confirmed. Mm -hmm. No, no. <laughs> right, no. 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 I mean, I, I could just. I, I think I have. I, have, I, have, I can change my oil real quick. I can change my tires real quick. And then I can ask Lilith, like, whereabouts, where you, about where you live at. And I could always just stop by. <laughs> you guys don't even know that information. Nobody does. Lilith knows about you, where you stay. <laughs> do you think I actually would give out that information? Yes. Uh, well, I, I think you would to the right no. person. Mm. Yeah, to the right person. Are you to sure? To the right person. Are you sure how... Mm -hmm. I, do you not know how much I can compulsively lie? Even when I'm... Even when I'm... More so what? So what awesome. you're saying? So what you're saying, Chu, is that if you told the truth to a particular person that you trusted, and you telling them that would lead to you getting bread, you wouldn't tell the truth. Yeah, because I'll stop what by. You, what, do you, what do you mean bread? What are you talking <laughs> about bread? What, what, no, what not VR. I, I don't. I don't think I don't think Hatchet is talking about B R E A D bread. I think he's oh. talking about like B R E D bread. The, the bread that I'm you try, occasionally I am, I, am I am trying my best. Oh, yeah, but I'm so sleepy. I can't even hold my head up. I mean, if, if you wanted to, I would totally like. Oh if my! If you're down. I don't want to go to bed. That's yeah, actually one me. thing, Momo. I would, I would love to meet everyone at some point. Yeah, that would be fucking awesome. Yeah, it really would be awesome. <laughs> but I can't. <laughs> I would love to meet every single technically, person. Technically, I could meet... Uh, uh, technically, I could meet uh, Hatch. Potentially. Yeah, probably. We're pretty close to each other. A quorum hush. You could and also meet also... you in chat. And Lilith. <laughs> but yeah, I can I can ask Lilith about kind of close. And they don't know exactly, but they know about where it is. And I could always do my detective thing and, you know, tell you that, hey, you know. 
we can do some shit if you want to. Just make oh sure you wear protection. We do some stuff. I've already told you that you got that nobody actually knows where it is. You underestimate my willingness. Well, nobody knows the specifics. Lie. Yes. We're we're not we're not saying that anyone knows the specifics. We're saying that were you to spill the specifics specifically to momo none of us here are going to hear it like we're not expecting you to tell everyone here <laughs> your address but if you were to specifically tell momo where you lived there is a non-zero percent chance that you would get to have a nice time with I momo totally come visit. i totally come visit if you if you if you like hey hang out like we could get like a hotel somewhere and stuff it'd be rad Just, like i said before make sure you wear protection and your lack of a response is all the is is literally all the answer we need to keep pushing. Once again, you're digging your own grave. Oh my I god. I think I did that. I think I, I okay. already did that the minute I tried to pull an all nighter to get these assignments done. That's well that's so, fair. Oh jeez. So I, I I just I just um Pulled somebody into a black hole. Christ. Meanwhile, which in a journal land. Hole? Wait, which type of black hole? Oh, I'm. Oh, God, shut up, right? <laughs> right. No, we're not doing this. Wow. <laughs> wow. That is. <laughs> wow. To the, to the fellow sorry. arrow ace, too. Sorry. Yeah, yeah, no, I, was no. say, aren't, I was about to say, wait a minute, isn't, aren't both of you people, or the creatures, no. beings, entities, aren't both of y'all? I'm only ace. Hey, Ace? Yeah. Okay. Uh, yeah. But, like, yeah, no, Adern is right, Aero Ace. Bi, so. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. By, by, by Rom Romantic. I'm so by sorry. By Rom. <laughs> That was just my immediate thought. By Romtic. Sorry. And like to clarify yeah, you, wanna, like, like... like to clarify you, if we're crossing boundaries here and you don't want us doing this, just tell us. No, I, I, oh, I'm, I'm legitimately I'm pretty... fine. I'm just having the time of my life watching you guys try to try and struggle to figure this out. No, you don't get that. We're not oh, currently not trying struggling. to get. We're not trying to get I'm your location struggling. necessarily. We're I just. Tr we're about that. at this point. We're basically trying to hook you and Pete and Momo up. At this point, actually, come to think of it. <laughs> why? That's basically what we're doing. Why would you be trying to do that? Okay. Why? There's one thing I wanted to say. My favorite response to that uh, about the black hole thing is mo is bookworms, in all caps, no. <laughs> but you see, Chu, that's that that's the thing. That's the thing, Chu. If you don't want to hook up with book with bookworm, why the god damn it? Oh. If you don't want to hook wow. up with Momo, <laughs> yeah, there's things have, things have been shot. moving and shaking since I've been gone. Uh, <laughs> if you don't want to hook up with Momo, then that still gives us information oh <laughs> on reasons oh. why those people have sway over you. Yeah. I'm not gonna give you a straight answer either way, because I don't want to make. I kind of, I kind of wonder if Asher is awake. Maybe me and Asher can both like chill. No, no, I, I think I, they I'm, might be asleep though. Yeah. I, at this I'm, point, yeah, yeah they don't, that. they don't stay up late like that. Yeah, Asher is <laughs> asleep, and I haven't gotten to hang out with them or speak with them too much lately, and that makes me sad. So in other words, mm -hmm. the thing that actually needs to happen is at some point, the Chu, the awake, Momo, though. and yeah, at some point, Mixes what needs though. to happen is the Chu, the Momo, and the Asher just all talk in a room together. The rest of us gone. Yeah. Oh, wait, Hatchet, <laughs> uh, Volcom responded to your, uh, Miss <laughs> They said, God damn it. Will, will you give us a pan answer? <laughs> <laughs> okay. Pan, what? Pan answer. Okay. Um, <laughs> okay. And with that, I think that was the final push I needed to fucking go to bed. Um. Here, here, here's the thing. Good job, bookworm. Here's the thing. You are all free 
to DM me your theories on what it is. In the meantime, I will read them in the morning. I am not me reading them tonight. I am going to bed. Just a bad pan joke. <laughs> nice. Says <laughs> Booker. You are Honestly, free, at to, this point, you are free to submit your book reports whenever you're ready. Honestly, at this point, I'm I think... I'm still kind of curious as to whether... I'm still w wondering if we should, like, start talking or not. That's all I'm wondering. <laughs> I don't know if I'm going to send you a book report. But I am kind of curious to see how that goes. Well, like, that's... You guys all have fun writing your reports. And that's the thing, too. Like, you got to keep in mind, like, 90% of, at the very least, my motivation here is literally just the tease you. I couldn't give, I couldn't care less about the truth. I just oh, want to fuck with you. Wait, oh, wrong word. I, I just want to mess with you. Oh, what? <laughs> yep, that's my ankle. That is my ankle, all right. All right, bedtime. My body is telling me go to bed. My 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 ankles. All right. My body I... always tells me to go to bed. Take care, Chief. Your ankles are weak. Uh, oh, have a nice day. Much. Yes. I'm sorry. Plus, I really need to pee, so I have to go. Bye. Take care, Bye, Drew. Take care. I have learned a lot today. <laughs> <laughs> I like yeah, Jen, not... oh, sorry. yeah, to clarify for absolutely everyone here, my entire goal really was just to pick on Chu. That's all that's that's my entire reasoning for doing this. Well, oh, yeah, no. well I just didn't Yeah, that was Huh. <laughs> huh. But yeah, ge well, genuinely like, Chu does fair, I kind of yeah, like genuinely, Momo Chu does like pretty much everything we've said. Every I, I will clarify in my saying I want to mess with Chu, Chu. Everything that I've said is my genuine perception of what's been going on in the way that Chu talks about you. Oh, <laughs> Chu loves him. Chu loves himself a brat tamer. Yeah. Oh, true. <clears throat> What yeah, well, you, what's my meal powers for in What, what, what did you expect? I I don't know. Not this. <laughs> I didn't. I wasn't hey, thinking. Momo, I gotta tell you something serious. Okay. Whenever you go to meet new people, we go to a hotel together. Wear a condom. <laughs> well, yes, I don't. Yeah, I well, listen. I don't. I don't usually. I don't do that with. Like, I don't do that with people that I don't really know or know. aren't friends with anyway. Yeah. So, <laughs> I am I am also Demi. So, like, I don't really, I don't really interact with people unless they are, like... Yeah. Like, I unless I know them. Or, 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 or like, I think the joke is that basically I've been trying to sleep with all of my friends. And that is partially <laughs> true. Um, <laughs> Sorry, like, Momo, it's not happening. Like, it's, I, I know. <laughs> it's no friends. Oh I still God. love you. That response, you sounded so sad. <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah, but it's okay. We don't have to. We don't have to take our clothes off to have a good time. Oh, no. Wait, Bookworm that's a really good song. You should look it up. Bookworm said maybe not wear a condom under normal clothes. That sounds uncomfortable. Well, no, you wouldn't. That's that's really that's that's not, that does sound really uncomfortable. Bookworm, bookworm taking. Uh, I love having Bookworm around because occasionally Bookworm just throws in a little nugget of random bullshit. Yeah, Bookworm, Bookworm over here dropping, dropping bombs. And Bryce said, "Where are you?" Yeah, remember, kids, That's when you go to a phone. hotel, always wear a condom. Always wear Under a your condom. clothes. Like, don't... Underneath your clothes. Yeah, Even if you don't plan on sleeping with a person, just wear the condom. <laughs> yeah, sex doesn't matter. Condoms are important at all times. Wear a condom at all times. It's just a cock sock. 
The thing... wear it, yeah, wear it, wear it, wear it over your fucking head. Like okay. you blow it up and you wear the condom you know, over the top of your head. Catch it. What we're describing right now was a South Park episode. Oh really? Yeah, where everyone in in within inch. Cartman's class was basically where all the males were wearing condoms to not get STDs. <laughs> Because that's what they thought. Wearing them. Yeah. yeah. Uh, I... yes. Uh, yes. So ridiculous. Ah, uh, yes. As we all know, everyone must wear a condom to stave off the... Uh... The fucking airborne STI. Wait. Bookworm, <laughs> Bookworm says it's just a mask for your dick. <laughs> well, I mean, yeah, basically. That is such a good one. It, when it, when it, yeah. Yeah, and that's pretty much. And remember, people, always mask up. <laughs> because masks, condoms are basically masks for your penis. Exactly. Penis masks. Hey, uh, Fumo, would you like to know how many olives I've fed to my lemon shark? Oh god damn it! I I I you have a lemon shark? Yes. It, yes, I'm looking at them right now. You have a what? You have a lemon shark. That's pretty cool. Yeah, it's right here. Actually. Right, right here, in front of my bike. Oh, okay. it's in the game. <laughs> it's in the game. <laughs> I was gonna say, I was like, well, I, in the game. I'm sorry. I thought you had an actual physical lemon shark. I was like, that would whoa. be. That would be Whoa, so. You have a lemon like, shark. I'm fairly certain that would be so fucking illegal. <laughs> yes. Yeah, I, I was like, can you even feed? Do lemons eat? Do lemon sharks even eat olives? Like, what? What, no. what planet? <laughs> what? No, they don't eat olives. They eat like lemon shark stuff. All right. Well, like, so why would they eat? How many olives, olives. I fed lemon is oh, nine hundred and forty-three. Why did you feed him so? Why did you feed him almost a thousand lemons? Or well, uh, olives. <laughs> olives. Because Bright's trying to find a shiny olive. Okay. So I'm fight. Yeah, we made the. Uh. Uh, we like when Bright got this guard chomp, or the younger version of the guard chomp. We I I made the joke that you should name it Lemon, like after a lemon shark, even though it's based upon a hammerhead and thus lemon was born and lemon decided to kill the bee instead of the olive <laughs> no lemon why just hates lemon bees? Hate bees lemon just hates bees why why does lemon hate pollination <laughs> although yeah bookworm fun fact if you didn't know this there actually is a hammerhead uh shark species that is like primarily a plant eater Oh, uh, yes. Uh, tomorrow. 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 Yeah. Uh, tomorrow. Tomorrow. Yeah. Yeah. I'm sorry. Go ahead, y'all. Yeah, uh, Momo, I'm guessing you didn't hear what I said. I am sorry. I was... No, I am working. Good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're good. You're good. Um... Uh, in case you didn't know this, there actually is a species of hammerhead shark that is primarily uh, a plant eater. That's really cool. And it is the only shark species that we know of that is fully omnivorous. It is the bonnethead shark. They live primarily in Florida, if I remember correctly, and their diet is 70% plants. Oh, you know, that's, that's really cool. That's yeah. fucking awesome. Bonnethead shark. They're also really fucking cute. I would like to see a picture of this being. This adorable being. Where I, is this? I will yeah. look one up. Yeah, I was gonna say, if I had my browser open, I'd send you a pic, but I do not. I mean, I guess I could just send you the card that I made for my fish deck. MUI Chew hugged us. Oh, hugged I don't think Momo knows this. All right, you know the Canon Workshop, and I have that, right? For my character, the channel, Momo. 
Yes. Uh, I'm going to tell you number 25 and number 26. Number 25. Bright has a, has children with a spider. 150 to be exact. Also, Bright was the one who gave birth to the children. That is high. And you know what? <laughs> How did, what did, who did you, you know what? Did, did, was it? Uh, um, <laughs> it gets better. Number 26. That's really adorable. Bright has a child with a watermelon. <laughs> How? <laughs> Getting further and further away in I'm terms so of confused. evolutionary relativity. I'm very confused. Um... <laughs> As to what bright even is, <laughs> like, oh, don't worry. In chapter three, it'll all be explained. Yeah, in chapter three, in we're gonna learn about you. In chapter three, it will all be explained. You know, because the first part, I don't think so. Because the first part of the chapter is called truth, and the truth is that you've given birth to one hundred and fifty spider children. <laughs> Asexually, <laughs> and have also somehow had sex with a fruit. Yeah, logic How... eludes bright. However, here's one thing that I am gonna say. It's a little thing to get people interested in chapter three. Let's see. Oh, we gotta find it. Find it. Oh, God damn it, fuck off ads. Where did I put it? Oh. Uh. Alright. So there's two SCPs, I will say, will make an appearance uh, of sorts. Kind of. The Hang King and the Startling Statue. That's all I'll say. That's all I'll say. If people know who the Hang King Dar, King, who the Hanged King Dar, <laughs> who the Hanged King Shut Dar, up. <laughs> who the Hanged King Dar, yeah, who you the Hanged King who, is, who, he are? Yeah, who the Hanged King is, then you'll understand. Yeah, I mean, I mean, everyone who's who's like even remotely a fan of the SCP knows who the Hang King Dar. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> But yeah, those two will make an appearance of sorts in Chapter 3, in part of Truth. Okay, that's that's getting added to my deck. Oh, fuck off. <laughs> and King Dar. So, it's King. Does Momo not know to hang King? No, I know who the King, hang king are. It's just yeah. I'm saying I'm saying it because you said it. All right. And now, because Bright said it, Momo just said it. I just kept saying it. Yeah. Oh. yeah, so I, I used oh. the, the grammatically, I used the grammatically incorrect saying. Hey, Momo, would you like to uh, know something interesting about the Hang King that me, Hatchet, Adarna, and Jiri found out? Are they a Rust player? Uh, they are related to the Scarlet King. Oh uh, well. But I, well, okay. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I assume they all play Rust. That's that's my, <laughs> and this is my pers this is my personal head canon, but they all they all play Rust because they just seem like Rust players. I just I don't. I can totally see the Scarlet me. King just like destroying everything while the Hang King's just trying to create a theater. <laughs> Yeah, he's just trying to build his own theater. <laughs> that really does sound like how we are in Minecraft. Yeah. <laughs> like, you're over there literally destroying, like, literally chopping up an entire mountain. While and Patrick's just trying to build a temple to fucking Thor or Odin. <laughs> oh, no, I'm more just, like, trying to set up stable living conditions for myself. <laughs> because I move all over the place. Hedge is homeless. Man. Basically, yeah. 
So yeah, I, I with that said, I do have to leave. But before you go, get back to my job last words oh. to your uh, last words to stream, Momo. Hey, stream. Um, I don't know. Stay safe, y'all. It's hard out here. If you need anything, let me know. My name is Solo Mode on Discord. Just contact me or whatever. And yeah, yeah. I found out that Pika has a crush on me. <laughs> also, Momo, Bokorn has one last thing to say to you. Uh, we also nuked an island in Minecraft. Yeah, yeah, that yeah, sounds that's... that sounds like a you move. Yeah, because like I, in in our realms world, mm -hmm. I had uh, been living on a nice little jungle island, but coming back to it, I was completely like I was just bored of living there. So I decided I was going to move. And I thought the best way I could go about dealing with that situation is just Bright and I both went into creative and blew the entire island the fuck up. Just nice. The, it, you know, there were other solutions that you could have made there and chosen, but I'm glad you came to some sort of conclusion about how you wanted to. Let I it mean, all the like that's out. the thing. That's the thing. The pandas weren't happy about it. Yeah, but no, I'm also, sure none of them. Yeah, you see, that's the thing. The pandas weren't happy about our decision, but they're also no longer around to file an HR complaint. So Wait, I think I'm fine. Yeah, with that. Hey, it, didn't you find yeah, them if, really? If, 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 rare panda in minecraft and we blew that it was up. a comp that was a completely different oh, okay. world so you, I, I would not you basically blow. extinguished an entire species oh no they're, they're still around oh. that oh. was just like a handful of pandas that lived on that island well i guess goodbye to them <laughs> okay one last thing momo before you can leave uh i want to send you a picture of something i want to stack Oh no. Frogs? No, <laughs> mountain chicken. Why would I stack frogs? I want to stack mountain chickens. What the, what the heck are you talking about? I I Why would I want Ah oh, man, I really <laughs> want Look, I really want to pet a doberman. I why, why would you say I want to pet a dog? <laughs> yeah, exactly. Oh, <laughs> it's a mountain Fucking chicken, dumbass. not a frog. I want to stack them up. They're not frog. They're man. It's not a, uh, what's it, uh, <laughs> it's like that really stupid, what was that one, like, I, when I used to watch Destiny, she was like, um, uh, she was like, he doesn't have a, a Benz, he has a Mercedes. And it was like, he, Dusty was like, wait, wait, what? It's <laughs> the same. Like, yeah, he doesn't have a Benz, he has a Mercedes, exactly, exactly, yes. It's, it's yes. the same stupid distinction the that same... Republicans, that, that Republicans try to do by saying, well, America's a republic. Not a democracy. Yeah, not a democracy. <laughs> we wouldn't have a yucky democracy. Please don't, please don't, please don't look up the definition of a republic. Please don't. <laughs> Constitutional republic, but it's also a fucking... You know what? Never mind. Sir, conservatives well, yeah. are dipshits. Mm -hmm. Conservatives yeah, are yeah. fucking dipshits. Every last one of them. Um, oh, God. My, my brain has been fucking getting murdered by paying attention to what Kanye has been up to. Yeah, yeah, uh, no. I if you want to have a conversation about that, I can't do it tonight cuz I'm working, but uh um, Yeah, I know. It's it's just I will, like, uh Thursday Thursday I don't work, so. Oh. Yeah. If you want man. to you want to totally chill and bitch about the stupid things that the artist formerly known as Kanye West wants to bloviate about i am down yeah so yeah what is it ye? yeah yes ye. ye or yay ye. rb it be it be yay but technically because his name's kanye but yeah well I um you, but you, i like calling him ye because he's fucking ye. yes ye. yeah i don't <laughs> i don't know yeah. i like I don't know how much I care about mispronouncing the name of a guy who sat on a stage with Alex Jones and was the least reasonable Nick, person in the room. Yes, he he sat on he sat on a fucking uh, in a recording studio with Nick Fuentes and Alex Jones and was the least coherent person in that entire conversation. Like you know, something's gone wrong when Alex Jones is trying to reel his guests back from a statement. Yeah. Oh, yeah. 
Yeah. Alex, and fucking you can see dumb. you can see how uncomfortable he was too. It's a yeah. testament to how fucking far the man has fallen and how I, much he has ruined his career. I kinda... And then and then and then meanwhile you've got you've got Nick Fuentes just sitting there with that shitty grin the entire time. He's literally like just the... there to be the guy that's next to Kanye as he burns his own plane. Yeah. I want to hit him in the face with a frying pan in Minecraft. Yeah. Uh, also <laughs> Uh, in I, Tetris, in Tetris, actually, I would like to uh, smash. Uh oh. Oh shit. No, I'm probably. Still here? Just... Yeah, yeah, you're here. Inter- oh, uh, uh, Derna uh, just has a lot of Wayne? internet. Yeah, Derna just has a lot of uh, internet sh- issues. Either way, I probably shouldn't keep sucking you in with talking about Kanye. Yeah, it's no problem. I um, yeah, I just, I do want to smash. Yeah. Nick Fuentes in the face with a uh, a cast iron skillet in Tetris. Yeah, or maybe maybe bright. Maybe we should plan to do. Uh, do you think it'd be possible to try out the uh, the new um, Among Us hide and seek mode on Thursday? Like, do a stream about that. Maybe I'll look. Then we could we could try it. I'm yeah, look then what we I'm could... doing. I'm not sure, but I might have had Thursday be the replacement stream for. The SCP tier listing. I, I'll look. Oh, that's fair. I, I'll look, but I don't think it is because I think I had it set for two a.m. at the end, which is not. A, I have work the next day after Thursday, so it wouldn't make it wouldn't make sense. So yeah, I, I'll so, double check and I'll let you know. Yeah. Point uh, being, I would love, said. I would love to oh, sorry, collectively no. diss on 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 Yi, while. Uh, potentially hearing Momo scream bloody murder in hide and seek. <laughs> you played be... this mode, so I probably would scream. You know what would be bad if I was the imposter and I went after Momo? <laughs> oh no, you just follow Momo the whole time. You don't even kill him. <laughs> <laughs> just, just, just stand right next to me. If you don't kill me, I will track you down. Like in real life, I will track. I will. I will track you down. I will drive to your to, to your place of dwelling, and then I will fucking put you in a backbreaker. <laughs> not like that. Not like like a wrestling move. Wrestling move. Backbreaker. Uh-huh, sure, not, Momo. Yeah, not, yeah. Just, no, yeah. Despite no, no. despite the general conversation surrounding two. Uh, <laughs> can you just like? <laughs> I'm talking about wrestling moves. I am talking about the actual move known as the backbreaker, the fucking thing. I, where you I mean, like your opponents. I mean, I, I mean back there over is the that. Top of your shoulders. I mean, see, that's the thing. There is that classic line, like if, if like, if like someone who's too young to explain this stuff to comes in on 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 on, on fun adult times, you just say, "Oh no, we were wrestling." Mm. No, this is this is this is. Oh no, no! This is I, <laughs> you've I, dug. I, you've I, dug, mm-mm. Momo. You've mm-mm, dug. This is not. This is this is literally the. I can I can search up the etymology behind this. <laughs> you won't catch me. You won't catch me in this one. I I am actually I am immune. Oh really? Mm-hmm. You're immune, even though your term the terminology you've consistently used could also be used in a dirty sense. Well, you know what? That's what happens when you hang out with fucking degenerates, okay? <laughs> well, yeah, yeah, but point being, you have dug your own hole, and now I'm beating you with the shovel you used. Well, you know what? Why am I still here talking, then, if I'm yeah, dead? Yeah, true. <laughs> well, no, yeah, you're not I'm dead. not dead. I want to kill oh. you. Oh, well... But, I, but either I, way. I, 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 I kill Bill punched my way out. <laughs> <laughs> Either way, yeah. Take take care take care of Momo. Good yeah, talking to nice, you. Have a, nice, have a nice night, y'all. Yeah. Take care. Good night, Momo. <laughs> Momo sent me pro pro wrestling fandom the backbreaker. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Anyway, uh Pokemon last words go. Wait. Just dead ass actually sourced. The wrestling man. Yeah. yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, like, Momo. comment, subscribe, yeah, and follow Bright, or else Lemon will find you and eat you.
Give her money and the odds of that will decrease though. He's <laughs> such an awesome guy to have Welcome, around. Welcome, you're, 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 I just realized your message, it, it, it's funny, but it also can be taken out of context. Like, comment, subscribe, and follow Bright, or else Lemon will find you and eat you. Give her money uh -oh. and the odds of that will decrease though. Uh-oh. <laughs> Don't tell Chu that she will never give she will never give you money in that. Uh, what money? <laughs> what oh yeah, money. true. What true. money? True. Uh, if Chu had money, they actually. wouldn't give you any money. What'd you say? Uh, Bookworm bonked me and you. Good. <laughs> I'm sorry, Book. Anyway, during our last words, go. I was thinking about the horny <laughs> Yeah. Anyway, go ahead, Adorno. Um. Follow, subscribe. Um. Always bully chew. Uh. And. Bright as a bird. Mm. All right. Uh, hatchet, last words, go. And remember, kids, those who are obstinate in continuing to harm innocent lives, those who stand in the way of justice and freedom, shall be torn asunder in Fenrir's maw, along with the slaver's chains they cling to. Oh. That, <laughs> that is a line... That I ran that I randomly came up with for like the latter end of my novel series. Yeah. Also, uh, my last words are actually going to be something that's that's also going to be a part of chapter three, truth. But I'm not going to spoil any more because I I I don't want this whole story to be spoiled. E. Obviously, number twenty seven. Wright has no parents. Wait, as in you're an orphan, or you just don't have parents in general? Don't have parents at all. You just, you just appeared. It'll all be explained in truth. It all makes sense. And then suddenly, Bright popped out of the ground like a wee little weevil. <laughs> I mean, that kind of... Spontaneous birth, says Bookworm. <laughs> and here we have the first noted mention of spontaneous birth here in human history. Yeah. Yeah. It's said that even the Son of God had to be carried in the body of a woman, but Wright surpassed that expectation by simply popping into existence at will. Yeah, basically what Chapter 3 Truth is going to do, it's going to explain why the Foundation wants her. Yeah. That's what, that's, that, that's the entire first part. E. Right, <laughs> right, Jesus confirmed. No. <laughs> No, 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 no. Bright is better than Jesus, because Jesus still had to be carried in the womb of a mother. Bright just came into existence. Bright just popped out of nowhere. Wait, Booker wrote, Jesus wishes he was as good as Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> that needs to go in quotes. <laughs> I meant bright, lol. But still, that's perfect. Jesus wishes he was as good as Jesus. Oh, my God. Curl C, which means I copied it, so I'll, I'll paste it. But, yeah. Oh, anyway, wow. Danger Noodles. Uh, that was a yawn. And, uh, yes. I, I hoped you enjoyed uh the massive amounts of bullshit that happened <laughs> the stream was nothing but bullshit jesus yeah actually yeah jesus has a wicked self-infuriating complex 
<laughs> Aw. Yeah. And uh, Oh, poor Jesus. <laughs> Aw. It's okay, Jesus. We all know your dad was an asshole. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, I hope two danger needles enjoyed. And uh hope to see you on our next mission next time.